good afternoon, good evening, good morning, everybody out there, YouTube land. This is Moz coming to you with a, another episode of Toy Photography Talk. <laughs> I'm having too much fun. Um, so tonight we're going to have an interesting show. It's going to be a smaller panel, but fun times, I should hope. And if I made you guys nauseous and you tuned out, you can come back now. It's okay. Um, anyway, let's welcome to the panel for the first time and the last time, Lou and Pablo. Yo. What's popping, yeah. people? <laughs> what up? What up? Champagne what up? wishes and caviar dreams for everyone who is a turtle fan and got their meds coat. <laughs> yes, mine come this week. There you go. There Hold you up. Go, I got to say this with a fork in my head. One of us. One of us. One of us. Yes, one yes. Of us, one of Speaking us. of which, let's let's give a shout out to the chat real quick before it gets way too long to like go through. Like, 20 people start saying, hey, 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 hey. And, you know, let's do it now while it's manageable. Noble Young in the house. Noble Young. He's got the little camera, a little, mm, and then I can't tell what the other guy's doing, and then some butt thing. I don't know what that is. Actually, League was here first, though. <clears throat> yes, yes, that's right. It's League's. I miss League. I, I don't miss. I, I said happy oh. birthday to League, but uh, League came in and said, hello, everyone. Have a great show tonight. Celebrating birthday today. Happy I'll, birthday. Happy, so happy, happy birthday. birthday. Happy, happy birthday. birthday. Happy, happy birthday. <laughs> What a burger birthday. <laughs> JP Rex in the house. Hello, guys. And uh, of course, we have uh, Denticus. Denticus. Is that right? Denticus? Yep. yep. Denticus. Game, folks. Dude, I'm getting pumped, man. I'm getting pumped, guys. This Friday, Ghostbusters, Frozen Empire, and then I go off the toilet. That's, oh, that's right. right. That's right. I don't know what I'm going to buy. I just don't know. Just Jeff in the house. I mean, Whataburger is good if you're dying and it's either eat that or guzzle Drano. <laughs> oh, damn. How dare you? <laughs> you got in and out, right? Dang. You, you damn. have in and out, right, Pablo? You have. Yeah, we, we got some in and out. And yeah, no. No? Yeah. You prefer Whataburger over in and out? No. Um, uh, who was it that turned us in, turned us on to this with, uh, last week? Uh, I think it was Toy Merch. No, uh, no, uh, no. Uh, Art with Toys. Yeah, Art with Toys, man. Guys, this is cool, man. Eight dollars on Amazon. I'm gonna take the camera real quick. Eight dollars on Amazon. It's a one twelve scale globe, and and if you're in a pinch, it's also a pencil sharpener. It's die cast. Eight dollars on Amazon. Looks really good. Looks they really had good. two different options, right? Those. Yeah, they had two one. different options. I went with that one, and then. Uh, you know, I just found this on a box I was going to throw away at work, so I kept that too. <laughs> I was like, "Hell with it! I don't really want Ariel. That's not my thing." But yeah, whatever. You know, you know, you like Ariel. That's right. You love Ariel. No, the cartoon you like one, you know, because that's the only one. There's no shame in it. There's no shame in it, brother. No no shame in it. I'm, I'm, I'm with you. Um, I'm with you. I, I love Ariel, man. She's a redhead. She sings, uh -huh. and if you just want her to shut up, you show her the witch, and that's it. Yeah. Just Jeff says, I say that as an Oklahoman. Yeah. How do you say that? <laughs> Oklahoman. Oklahoma. All right. Well, uh, I should uh, open up uh, the things that I need to open up today. Mm -hmm. I haven't opened up anything. I'm so bad at opening up things. <laughs> um, Real quick, Marsh, I just want to thank you and I want to thank Pablo for joining me on Half Show Saturday this past Saturday. Yeah, you dude. Awesome. Thank you. Yeah, for sure, man. Thanks for having us, man. Thanks, <laughs> thanks for being a rock star, Lou, like you always are. Man, I even took a photograph live on his. You took, yeah, yeah, <laughs> and he was hiding it very well. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna skip a little little bit because we don't have Trevor to to police me today. Um, oh, no police, man. It's all about the feet pics today. Um, well, and no, I don't have any feet in this picture, but <laughs> it, it, it has to do with it has to do with that horrible crow trailer, and uh, this is how I feel about it. I have not seen it yet. I have not seen it yet. I have so, not seen it yet. I don't have a, a Jarrett Leto Joker. Otherwise, I would have used him in this picture. Uh, I had to go with the Bill Skarsgård Pennywise, so it, it does affect because Bill... But I don't have anything personal against Bill Skarsgård. It's just, you know, but that's that's what I had. So uh, that's the Sideshow Crow, 1-6 scale, 1-6 scale, Hot Toys Pennywise. And I, I snapped that last night, you know, just... And this is a AI-generated floor here. So. Oh, nice. Yeah, I needed something. I needed something there. So, so the AI generator would match the colors. Yeah. That's there. 
Yeah. Nice. Nice. It's, uh, the, the Photoshop AI is pretty, pretty darn good. I mean, you have to. I That's think I went through 36 possible matches before I found the one I liked because it was throwing a whole bunch of garbage on the street. I was like, give me some garbage. It's like, boom, here's too much garbage. And I was like, oh. <laughs> um, so I think I finally said dirty alley or something, and I finally got that because uh, I tried sewer and it was like doing like this pool effect, like because my edging that I drew, like for the top, I, I you know, came in around here. So mm -hmm. it was like drawing this this pool edge like thing. I was like, that's not gonna work. So uh, yeah, go figure. Go in the house. You started on time. We did. We did. And uh, we all crown. We all. I think they meant drown. Uh, crown down here is what he said, but I think he meant drown. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> um, but anyway, I wanted to do that while I was getting that ready. Um, we'll go over it again later. You know, in like three weeks, we'll actually go over it. Uh, but it won't be as pertinent then because the trailer have been out. You know, so I just wanted to. I just wanted to give it some some love now. Let me uh, mm -hmm. let me uh, type in Instagram. Yeah, Instagram dot com slash blah blah blah. That might be helpful. <laughs> well, I was getting there, man. I was getting there. Yeah, be there we go, man. There we go. Um, where do we leave off? I, I know I, we made it a point of like we left off here, and then I've already forgotten. So. Uh, we left. Uh, we left off on. I believe it was Brain's toy chest. It was a shot after yours, wasn't it not? It was the one with that had um oh wait, you know what? Mm. No, I've never met what, but I, I'm I'm really anxious to meet this guy. Everybody keeps asking if I know him. Wah, wah, wah. Oh we saw oh no, we saw that Frankenstein. Never mind. Mm -hmm. uh, I think I went down too far. Hold on. No, Frankenstein was I think close to where we stopped at though. Was it was it uh, was it the uh, Nork Frankenstein that we stopped at? Was it his shot? I don't know. Let me find the Frankenstein. I'm still scrolling for frack sakes. Wait, there we go. Frankenstein. I think that's where we did stop at. Who was that? Right. Yeah. Yeah. I think we stopped there because I don't remember doing. Yeah, I don't remember doing Clone Wars. Uh, yeah, Clone I don't remember War. doing that. Yeah. Yep. And it's all Lou's fault that I remember that. Controversial toys, aka Casper, Casper in the house, happy after work hours, everyone. Yes, I had to work today, it sucked. Um, and of course, uh, yeah, that top photo I just added. Yes, yes, you did. <clears throat> All right, so I think we're on Clone Wars 504. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we did some real action, uh, rainy effects, man. Nice, okay. so when you're doing this kind of effect, guys, before you get into the critique, in case you haven't done this before, A, you need a fast shutter speed, B, you need a lot of light because you need a really fast shutter speed. And also, yeah. <laughs> if you pay attention to like movies and stuff, you don't actually see rain happening unless there's light shining through it. Through it, yeah. like, particularly towards the camera usually helps most, but uh, not necessarily. But it, it's almost a given you'll get it if you get the light heading towards the camera. Yep. So just keep those things in mind if you want to use real rain effects. Um, fast shutter speeds and light. Lots of light. Actually, flashes work <laughs> best. Um. And not like you know the the gremlin flash, you know, we, um, but you know, flash like the camera flash. Um, so yeah, let's get on with that, Pablo. Since Lou went AFK camera thing, yeah. that was a dope shot. I, I, I like the water effect in the bokeh on some of the droplets. It looks like the big droplets that either landed on the lens or something were pretty big, <clears throat> but the rain itself got captured pretty well. You know, in order to get rain like this, you need like a one five hundred shutter. I mean, you need a really fast shutter. Yeah, I mean, fast, incredibly fast. Which means you need hell of light. Like, I don't think I have enough light here to put out for one five hundred shutter speed, unless I got daylight with me. Oh, I got plenty of that light. <laughs> yeah, I know you do. You use a flash. Okay. <laughs> got plenty of that light. Real um, <laughs> figure go says a lot of blue light cut with white light can keep your photo dark and capture the rain yeah, yeah. it depends but they the can the they will work but i don't know if it's going to do enough it will work but now this is a good shot the lighting's good on yeah you know, he's got enough light on the trooper yeah yeah this is this is pretty rock star right mm -hmm. this is i think a black series um i think so yeah i think so lou what do you think are you here uh, Lou gets no opinion on this picture because he is dead at the time. Because he's Lou. 
fine, Lou. He's popping. It's Clone Wars 501st is missing out on the Lou. You know, that's I'm sad. I'm bad for Clone Wars. Too, too bad. <laughs> Moving on, man. Moving on. Thank you so much, Clone Wars 501st. Um, Commander Green in the house, man. Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Green. <clears throat> oh, yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. There you go. <laughs> Pick that up. He just didn't want to work with me, man. All right, so we got oh, uh, the Bronx bats. bat again. His lighting's getting a little better. Yeah, but it's still he's still right up on the background, like we talked about last week. Yeah. This shot was probably taken way before we talked about this last week, so we'll cut him a little slack there. Um, But yeah, you need, you need to pull him off that wall and not throw so much light at the wall directly, particularly if you're not going to follow the shadows that are on the card. Yeah, um, I'll put the light above. Yeah, just do top down lighting on stuff like this. I mean, mm -hmm. um, that would give you a lot more to go on. Just one, if you do one light, do top down. Don't ever do straight at them uh, or, or come in from one side. But uh, to catch all this group and give them as a decent chance of light, you'd want to come at them uh, kind of behind this guy, but up here and just kind of diagonally across them. Just if you're not doing top down, you know, or, or even from this side, same thing. But um, so you'd be in front of them, but but also kind of diagonally down towards them. So um, that's going to be your best bets. Yep. I agree. Pablo. Agree. You, you always agree with me, man. Don't you have your own opinions? Not always, man. Sometimes we disagree. Yeah, man. It should have been raining outside that shot, man. <laughs> See, you still bringing that up. <laughs> I won't let it go, man. What's up, Sketch Toy Corner? Yo, yo. Let it right. go, Moz. Let it go. Lou, you got anything? <laughs> Damn, Lou. Failing awesome, awesome. Brock's bat. I'm sorry. Lou is failing you, too. <laughs> All right. Thanks for sharing this, Brock Bat. We'll move it on. We're going to make some headway today. Raven Eyes Studio, Studio Toy Mercs uh, shot here. Let, oh, wait. We got a couple. Okay. Oh, this is all right, collapsed. All right. Cool. So yeah. we're just on this one. I'm digging this. Pablo, I, I've talked through both of the last ones, man. Go. That was pretty dope. Uh, I, don't know, I need to bring it up on my screen. Hold on. Leroy Jenkins. Like, go figure. Go says Lou fell into that bowl. <laughs> he said feel, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to assume he meant fell. I I, 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 do shot, I do like the shot that I wish it was a little sharper on the eye. The armor seems to be sharper than his face. Yeah, a little bit. Um, I wish there was a little bit more light on the unknown one in the back, just a little bit, so it doesn't look like a black void. What's wrong with a black void? I like black voids. Yeah. Well, you can't tell what it is if it's a black void. This is true, but I like them. They're cool. I mean, it looks good though. I like I like the shadowy like vibe he has in the background, but I, I wish he had like a little bit more of that red light on his armor. And then, of course, yeah. Vorgus in the front. Uh, he's well lit, but I think uh, another like a maybe a bounce light underneath him, just to bring in a little bit more of that armor. But he's lit. I, I do like the way he's lit. It's just the unknown one character in the background that needs a little bit more lighting. What's up, Sath? Amateur hour. I did a thing. Just saying. I did a thing. I did a thing. Um, <laughs> it's a good shot, though. I, well, I like there's it. something you didn't notice, Pablo. He's he's actually lit Vlad wrong. If you look at the trees in the background here and the shadows, the shadows are cast towards the camera. Yeah. So yeah. really that light should be coming from back here. From back here. This way. Maybe a bounce on this side, but the light, if you want to follow that background, should have been coming across here. Um, which is actually, I think, the way I honestly would have lit it anyway. But because I don't like how dark this is here. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Put a bounce card on, like have him standing on it just to bring in some light. But that wouldn't have been an issue though if he came across this way. He might, again, sure. he might have needed some more over here, but yeah. Um, but yeah, you got to remember where your background's coming from. So this is all showing me that the shadows are cast kind of towards the camera. Um, and uh, it would have been hard to light him too. You would have had to throw an extra little light in there to give him some substance. But uh, yeah. 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 Vlad would have definitely benefited from the light coming across this way and then uh, playing with some bounces on this side. Lou? What do you think, man? This is the third picture. You need to say something or you're fired. I'll tell you this right now. Um, <laughs> the picture is kind of dark, but it's lit weirdly. Um, I'm going with you, Amaz, um, with this. Uh, I would put a little bit more of a 
like a reflective light bounce light um onto the wings at least of um uh, the uh, unnamed one in the back and um i don't know the posing <sighs> let, me, let me enhance my eyes because i'm i'm multitasking here well i, I kind of well, like the, the pose is the not bad no it's not the pose is not bad but um it's uh -huh. not nice armor you know you don't expect them to do spider-man stuff but um yeah. right I want to do a slam dunk right now. <laughs> no, I, I would, I would probably, I probably put a little bit more light on the main subject, just to have him stand out just a bit more. Um, on his, uh, on our right side, camera left, whatever. Yeah. I'm starting. <laughs> Make so. camera right, our left. No, wait, no, it's right. It's just right over all, all. It's yeah. their left, our right. Yeah, their left, our right. Yeah. yeah so. Yeah. But it's still a good shot. Still yeah. a good shot. You, you know what? Studio, it's, man. I love the, the colors here. I love the colors here. We're trimming the edges. We're trimming, We're trimming the edges. The, edges. the diamond in the rough, baby. You just gotta, yeah. you know, brush off those edges. I, I love what you're doing with the colors here, though, and I do like the way he's lit here. But he does need more definition. I, yeah, I love just a little bit. These like colors that. are playing off of him. Yeah. All right. We're gonna move on, though. Raven eyes. Thank you so much. We're gonna make a big dent today, man. Who needs Trevor? <laughs> As, as he comes in. <laughs> Amateur hour. We got some Harry Potter with a Kestrel. No, Kestrel or Thestrel? Thestrel? Kestrel? I don't know. Thestrel. Kestrel is an Eve spaceship. Thestrel. Yeah. 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 Good use of the, the Mythic Legion's four horseman horse, the, the vampire horse. Oh, is that what that is? Mm -hmm. I thought it was a Thestrel. You could That's be a close shot. It's a cool shot. I like the angle. Um, but it, I don't know if the no, I don't know. It seems like the face is a little soft for some reason. I don't know why. I think it's a figure. That might be the figure. But well, I mean, the... tilted his head towards the camera. I don't like how it's tilted away from the camera. It's all all going that one side, and I kind of need. Need it to come out a bit more, and and I felt like it tilted more towards you know character left, camera right. Yeah, I, I think that would have worked more in the favor of the picture. I don't know. Want to play with it for sure? Yeah, keep talking about. It. I'll be right back. Let me just grab something real quick. Lou, what do you think? You're a pose guy. It looks good. I would have probably had the other hand um a little bit more relaxed. Um, instead of just like having it outright and have him kind of like look a little bit more towards uh, like the bridge of the nose of the horse mm. because right now he's looking at the head but he's pet petting him under his chin and with a horse you kind of want to know where your hand is going you know you don't want to get your hand bit off um because th them suckers hurt <laughs> but yeah. um but then again you know this is Harry Potter, you know, it works. But I would have changed the position of his left hand and brought it down to his side and uh, brought the other hand like if he was feeding him an apple or stuff, you know. Mm -hmm. like, they, they need to smell you. They, they play with you with their lip a little bit or have the hand uh, caressing the um, his uh, snout in between his um, eyebrows and whatnot. It's like right there on top of his head, you know. Like places you normally would, you know, a horse will allow you to touch because getting underneath them, you know, you have to be like really close to them uh, from what I've witnessed because yeah, I do work, you know, at the casino with the horse uh, tracks and whatnot. So, you know, I do see a lot of those uh, different interactions with them. But then again, we're looking at a dead horse that's in Harry Potter. So you never know. You know, it's always up to interpretation. Um... I think the lighting's okay. Oh, what do you think on the lighting? I think the lighting's okay. Hey, there's Mikey Boo. Hey, and there's hey, Boo Boo. The chat. Look at you. Equestrian safety yeah. time with Loco Lou. That's right. I'm the crazy <laughs> one. Listen, don't be me. Be better than me. <laughs> no, the lighting does a good job. Of, I think it's actually shot outdoors. It looks like it's the lighting's matching everything outside. Mikey. What's up? What's going what you on? Think, you guys hear me? How's your tire, man? You what a day. 
You don't want to know. <laughs> rolling at least. Rolling, rolling, rolling. It's only flat on the bottom, is what I told him. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah it's just the bottom. the bottom. It's just the bottom. Just air the bottom up. That's what I was. <laughs> you know. <clears throat> yeah. All right. Yeah. This is a nice shot, though, man. Amateur hour. I like this, man. Yeah, it's a nice uh, shot. All right. Well, looks look, looks good. Part of the part of the thing with with shooting a, a or not I don't want to say oh. shooting uh, photographing a, a a black horse, you know, black anything on on the, on the outside is, you know, uh, trying to get it lit up enough to yeah. mm -hmm. to show without it, you know, <clears throat> blowing out and stuff. But you got a good amount of highlight, and there's a backlight to it too, a nice little natural rim light on the other side. You did yeah. a great job matching the uh, light to to a digital yeah. background, apparently. It's just yeah. a real log oh, nice. with the tree right next to him, but the rest is digital. Nice. Did a great job. <laughs> yeah, you did a good job is, matching the light. Is, it, is that a big horse tooth going through the mouth there? What is that? That white it's thing? So horse that's horse that's, that's uh that's Harry's uh, hand. Oh. Just because the, the horse hit is the vampire <laughs> horse from Myth of Visions. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Right on. I'm like, Jesus, yeah. that's a big tooth. Right on. <laughs> well, we like our teeth here. No, um, only the one, only the ones we use. Casper's trying to raid our stream. What does that mean? I don't know what that means. I don't know. Yeah, I don't, don't know. know. All right. Amateur hour, man. We're going to move on. Thank you so much for sharing, though, man. It's beautiful. Ooh. Oh, good good. Shot, but yeah. uh, I'm going to say this right eventually. Uh, it's Pam. Now I'm just stuck on it. Denticus. Denticus. He was Denticus. On Thank you. This it's one worth in the chat. I can say that one. That's pretty easy. And uh, go figure, go. And of course, uh, we have KJ Smith. KJ, come on, KJ. Up, peeps. Seth, thanks, guys. What's up? What's up? What's up? Yeah. Let me mm -hmm. see what else we got over here, real quick. Okay. All right. So this is what we're working on here. This is a nice shot using the one thousand toys synthetic humans. Is that what that is? Yeah, that's, that's, what what that's the, both the male and the female synthetic human. And they have these faces that snap mm -hmm. on or something too. Yep. That is cool. I get I get the sense that they're toasting to a plan well well uh well executed. You know, <laughs> yeah, well executed. Yes, we finally got them to blow themselves up. <laughs> awesome. Well the, the caption says happy belated Valentine's Day, all, all practical with some light room exposure tweaks. Well, love is strange. So okay, get ready for this to happen on April 8th. <laughs> <laughs> this is God. this is what's gonna happen in April eighth. <laughs> um, well, I'm gonna Casper, call in sick that day then. So good, Casper. The, the link you you have that you tried for Streamyard is an old link. We're not there. You're not by, backstage anywhere. You're 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 in some limbo old thing. Yeah, you're in an old old one. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, as to this call. picture though, Denicus, was there any way to get a little bit more light on her face? I mean, his I think is okay, but. Her face is a little darker, and I, I kind of want a little bit more light in there. I don't know. What do you guys think? Yeah, I could use a little bit more bounce light just to to um, to match his face, like to get more of that the, of her teeth exposed. Yeah, but I, I mean, I, I do I, like this concept, though. I mean, this is just a brilliant yeah. shot. This is this is great. His behind you here, this is practical, man. Did you how did you make the mushroom cloud? That looks pretty real. Did you, did you blow up Vegas? <laughs> Practical. And so the window, the window is one of those uh, foam inserts that come with your microwave or TV. Oh shit! Oh, yeah. Cool. yeah. <laughs> oh shit! Right. Cool. See, that's how you do it. That's how you do it. Yeah, like, <laughs> like, yeah, that's lame. I was waiting for fifteen minutes. <laughs> yeah, he had it on his behind the scenes, man. Um, yes, I don't I think he has the behind the scenes on here, but I think I was on his. Oh, well, oh yeah, yes, yeah. There we go. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Oh, nice, man. Oh, yeah, you had that on the screen. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's awesome. Well, when he said it was all practical, I thought the explosion was real, too. I thought he nuked somewhere. <laughs> you tell me where you want me to send one. I'll send the nuke. Yeah, just nuke it. Just nuke it. Nuke them. Get them before they get you. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that's pretty that's nice. A great man. shot, yeah. Nice shot. Sweet. All right. All right. <clears throat> Thanks, it on. Thank you, Denicus, man. Awesome. Awesome. Ooh. Ooh. Toy Nostalgia 82. Uh, we got this Tiger Dude, which I still kind of want, but I haven't bought yet. Something Master Blade. I know Lou knows. Did you say what? The name of the character. Masticate? Right? Oh. Master Blade. <laughs> what? Oh, Master, Master what? Masticate. 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 <laughs> Duke Nuka Cola, 
crossover of the year. <laughs> right? Yeah, no joke. This is pretty awesome, man. Um, I, 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 this is a nice outdoorsy <laughs> shot. I even don't dislike the, 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 the height of the grass in this. I think it works for this shot. I do feel you needed a bounce over here. Yeah, I was going to say. Just, around. He's, yeah. he's, he's a little dark on that. Um, Other than that, the, yeah, the setup is great. The location. Yeah. Yeah, even, even just a piece of printer paper would have worked right there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just, just a little about, bit down here, just kind of bouncing it out. Mm -hmm. that, cause, you, know, just keep it you, you know what I would have done instead? No. Would have um, enhanced and give it more of that um, wide Enhance. shot and focus okay. into him kind of cut the blades of the grass that's on the bottom and go closer to where his feet is or even cut his feet all together and go by the <gasps> middle and um <gasps> trim the top skyline so that way you just see where the clouds are on you the don't cut the feet lou for I that you must pay <laughs> <laughs> I would, I would crop it a little bit more and bring it down instead of making it square, making it more of a rectangle and just getting that whole um, kind of like a, I want to say like going to the movie theater, the screen is nice and clear and you just see that nice wide cut of everything there, the, uh, the main subject there, just enjoying the scenery and just like, mm. yeah, it was done. Sort of. Sort of a 16 by 9 because there's a lot of yeah. empty sky there with no sky interest. Usually, if you have a lot of sky, you want some sky interest in there, but there's 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 not I like clouds except to the right side. Exactly. I, I like that. You know, I get the I get yeah. the, the impression of like Mount Fuji kind of thing, you know, over here, even though it's not tall yeah. enough. But I mean, yeah, I get yeah. That, 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 that kind of Japanese kind of vibe. It doesn't sure. help that I watch Shogun today. Yeah. Oh, yes, Shogun, baby. Shogun, Shogun. <laughs> Such a great show. Um, yes, is it video, JP Rex. Do you have a problem with the foot? Oh, don't get me say no, JP Rex. Just say no. <laughs> Just say no. Do Mike a favor. He can't tolerate all that foot. Um, Casper says, by the way, Saturday was a year from when I shared my first photo on the show. Oh, hell yeah. Right, bro. Facebook memories got to love them. Yeah, it does come in handy sometimes. Hell yeah. Congratulations on one more year. And of course, one whole year. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah. Um, toys and Stylish, man. Yeah. Just a little bounce card. I think you would have had something really, really... I mean, it's a nice scene here, but you would have had something just chef's kiss, you know? So. Uh, yeah, because I think if he would have focused more, like, zoomed in and focused more on the face of um, Blade Master, uh, the light would focus more onto him, and we would get the uh, light that we're suggesting. And because if you focus more on it, it's going to gravitate more towards that light, and whatever light is about off of the blades of the grass will, you know, pop off onto his face. So okay. that's that's what I'm I'm suggesting. But other than that, this is great. I love the concept. You know, composition looks great. Um, and being outdoors, catching that light at the right time of day, you just have to be on time and just you know do, do what you're doing, man. Because shoot, I can't do it because I don't uh -oh. have scenery like that i'm in new york baby don't worry about that are you are you trying to fill the pot the the, 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 the trevor <laughs> void right here trevor, trevor man, Master. pablo's trying to steal your move man <laughs> what's well, the crop well, what's the crop I would, I would pablo a little bit lower yeah you get a little bit lower, lower. like yeah like, you want to get his like, head up higher in the, the machine higher man. And, and cut him hmm. by the knees. You know what I mean? Like, I, well, it is cut at the knees already. No, 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 no. no you cut it too short it, already, man. Go back. Cut it undo, too short. undo, redo your crop. Remember, the tigers got two knees. They got, they got, they the double helix kind of thing going on. You mean the ankles? <laughs> That's not an ankle. His ankle this is, is a knee. Foot. This is an ankle. <laughs> no, that's not an ankle. That's a this is a knee. Put the tool back this on is an ankle. ankle. Where? Where's the cankle? <laughs> That's the cankle, bro. That's the cankle. <laughs> Put that the part in the middle. The ankle meat. It's a joint there. It's the part in the middle. All right, bring the bring bring the photo up higher. Bring the photo up higher. Get his head a little bit higher. Right there. Right, there. right about there. Yeah, that's where he's going with that man. And then and I could hear Mike. He's like, "Why did you cut the foot?" <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> well, the foot's going to be cut. I don't mind. I don't mind cutting a foot. I don't mind cutting a foot. It, it is a bit of a. It's, of the it's, in, the, it's, anyway. in, the, it's in the grass, anyways. He, the foot is yeah. already gone. That, so. And that's where yeah. I was going at because you know it is tall blades of grass. You're not going to see the foot. Mm -hmm. yeah, oh, you will. Oh, you will see the foot. You will. <laughs> You will. If, if Mike has anything to do with it, you're gonna see some toes, baby. You're gonna see some toes. <laughs> you're gonna see some toes. <laughs> that does. That does fix the wide open. That, it does fix the wide open sky though, because there was a lot of empty sky there, and you could see some banding yeah. in it. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, uh, you can see some banding of the color and stuff, and so that that fixes that problem. You know. Yeah, I'm digging this, man. Now we just need to maybe bring the was it Dodge Burn, whatever the one that brightens that brighten it up. Maybe yeah, brighten this up. There. I would have, I would have. Honestly, Dodge, I would have right? put. Dodge. Yeah, do no. just a gradient, just gradient, gradient. a yeah, gradient, curve yeah. adjustment layer, something. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna go through all that. Right yeah, now. we're not gonna do all that. <laughs> no, but, yeah. <laughs> no, yeah, rock on, well, man, rock on. I'm gonna that cost. That's a ten dollar donation for that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Toy Nostalgia 82, man. Thank you so much for sharing. Moving on, we're going to keep going. Toy Pick 40s. Toy pick 40s. I like Trevor's response. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, what did Trevor say? Hold on. What did Trevor say? Oh, I, I didn't have the chat on there. Uh, where, where's, where's it at? Where's it? Dang it. Stop it. Coppin <laughs> ain't like <laughs> dusted the crops back home, boy. <laughs> <laughs> or something like that. <laughs> Oh, Look, oh, about on the panel, his comments are just on point, bro. All right, Toy Tech, man, I'm digging this, man. I'm digging this suit, oh, this nice. but I have to ask one thing: what is going on with his shoulders? He's got like this weird, like hunchback of Notre Dame shoulder thing going on. I can't figure it out. Does he have really long arms? I don't know, man. That's no, what I'm it's, saying. It's the, it's the figure. It's, it's the figure. And is this McFarlane? Is that why? No, it's it's very that awkward to pose this figure. This is a Mayfex. It's that's not a Mayfex. It says May there's all the tags. Maybe one of the other figures of Mayfex in. I don't know. Yeah, look at the knee joints. That's not a me a Mayfex knee joint. <laughs> What the hell? Oh, diamonds? No, it wouldn't be diamonds. Look at the thigh. Diamond. Also, the thigh has a weird cut too. Yeah, dude. What the hell is going on here, <laughs> dude? I'm gonna tell you this right now. That that figure is posed very awkwardly, and it kind of looks like he's going for a side step, and he's kind of like throwing his cape to the side. Dude, he just needs to go like this, like like. <sighs> yeah, but I think it's over dramatized with the shoulder drop because I see what Maz is saying. Um. Yeah, it's a his, little. His arms look really long. Yeah, they look like spot cutter arms. I mean, they look right. long. Yeah, they look that long. One, right. His it right looks arm like... looks super long. And it well, makes even... it worse that that ab crunch is crunched forward. And Dude, tilted. look who's in the chat, Lou. Oh, what up, Jay? what's up, Jay? What's up, fam? We should send Jay a link and see what he's going to say. Good. Hope everything's good. I hope your health is good, my brother. Can't wait to see you again on Thursday whenever you get a chance. And uh, half show Saturday, um, not this Saturday. The following Saturday. All right, Turtle Toy fanboy in the house too, man. What's up, Woody? What's up? I, I'm just. I am curious on why his arms look so long. Like, just did he did he stretch arms, out the arms? I or I mean, he stretched out the is, photo. No, I think, and I want to oh, honest to God say that this is the McFarlane Batman. The McFarlane. Oh, the, the don't McFarlane know what it is, Batman. man. It's freaky. Well, except did the McFarlane Batman, this Batman from McFarlane, did it have a a soft kids cape? Because that's a soft kids. Oh, people, people do swaps. Constantly, people have been doing swaps. You could buy the uh, 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 a cape for that particular figure for like uh, I want to say 10 20 bucks. So, to enhance your 20 dollar figure with 20 dollar cape that actually has bendy wire, it's soft goods. Uh, that's true. It, because it, I, it, I mean, it's like that, but Jeff says it's got the McFarland diaper. I See? think that's the only with the diaper, though. Nope, nope, they adopted it. it he like, doesn't tag McFarland, it says DC official media com. I'm I don't see McFarlane tagged at all, man. He just, not like oh, Toy Attic says it's Mayfex. Oh, is it? Mayfex? Wow. Mayfex is Batman came out already? I, dude, this is what he's right here. He's saying it. Mayfex is Batman came out already? It, that, mm. What I want to know is what angle he... Whose arms are those then? Mm. <laughs> they look so weird. I mean, I love the color. Don't get me wrong. I know I'm picking light 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 those, but... The, the, the color nice. and the lighting and, and everything is really cool, but the, the pose is like throwing me off. Like, 
Did, did, he, did he kill the hunchback in Notre well, Dame and take his arms? I don't know. Might have did a little bounce on camera, right? Just to bring that yeah, other arm out just a little bit. So there's not so much of its shape left to the imagination. We might be making it longer in our minds than it is. Well, it, could be, it could be a play so the the arm, line, I guess. But so the arm that's in the in the shadow, you can see the hand. Yeah, there's the hand right there. Yeah. The arm the hand so right it looks there. like yeah. if you straighten out that arm, it almost looks like the hand reaches his knees. That's why it looks – Yeah. The arms look like they're stretched. And I, yeah. I don't know if there was something done in post that did that or – I don't know. Because I don't think the angle – that it was shot at would have done that. It's just a, it is no. the it is the Mayfex. That's what he just said. He it's his no, no, picture. No, 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 no. He but, knows what he's talking I had about. To look at it, dude, because his knee pads <laughs> are atrocious. His knee pads are horrible. Okay, but I love the, but the lighting's awesome. I mean, aside from the figure itself looking weird, the lighting's great. Yeah. What is that on the floor? The left there, yeah. lower it left frame. Like what is that? It looks like a lamp. A fan. A a lamp. Lamp. It's a lamp. It's oh, a lamp okay. running off the yeah. top of the, the, the lamp, you know. The I, said, I got you. It's been knocked over. I see yeah. what it is now. Yeah. Okay. I couldn't tell. I don't. Yeah, the lightning's awesome. I, I, I like the lightning. Yeah. And I like the way the whatever character is on that chair that Batman's looking at with the bag over its head. Like yeah. got a few few dust particles down there on the bottom yeah. or they're yeah. and they're where they're supposed yeah. to be. It's well, the well, you needed to throw a little blur on them though. They're they're a bit they're yeah. a bit sharp. Now I know what's wrong with it. Yeah, hmm. <clears throat> I know what's wrong with it. It's that ab crunch. Like I see it. Like they even showed it when they um doing uh the articulation segment in the photos on Big Bad Toy Store, where you see um the, what poses you could possibly do with the figure. It has a very high um upper joint, so you can get a very deep crunch. But because it's so deep and so to the side, it makes them look lopsided. Plus of the Dutch angle, it just makes it all kinds of weird. What I'm trying to figure out, Lou, is it, is this the Mayfex Batman or which is one is this? Mayfex. I I don't. Is it? No, I'm just playing. <laughs> it's the Mayfex. It's the Mayfex. You guys give me a headache. <laughs> hey, listen, I'm telling you, those knees confused the shit out of me, bro. I was like, wait, no. All right, all right. No, but I do. But I mean, aside from the figure itself, I mean, it's not about the figure; it's the shot itself. The lighting's great. Yeah. And the composition is fantastic. I like the yeah. The story is awesome. The Just lighting's fantastic. Arms and the hunched shoulders are really what's what's doing it. I'm like, what what what's going on? I don't get it. But other than that, yeah. Angle and the and the pose of the figure because it's in a Dutch angle and he's crunched over. So it's like, is that a proper stance? It's like because you can see how in the wall in the back that the other gentleman that's there, the gangster. That's whatever. Jeffrey Wright, man. That's Commissioner Gordon. Can't you tell? I can I tell. Can't tell. That's blurred out of my. my I can tell it's him. I can't tell shit. Dude, that's the watcher, I, man. I, I can't tell. Shit. Obviously, you know, I got the. That's the dude from Westworld, man. He's like the cool guy. All right. I I might have. Well, it's an artistic choice, but I might have put the guy in the back on camera right to create a balance. But yeah. Uh, Let me get that would Batman feel further back though, like further to the left to kind of counter that. Mm. Well, there's a lot of space him on a, over there. I mean, right. on the third here, this guy on this third here, and he's off yeah. the third. Yeah, if so. if you put him over on camera, yeah, camera yeah. right in there. But that that's just an artistic choice. Then you yeah, look like Tim with his bar going through his head too. That might drive you nuts, Mike. You watch out for that. No. Uh, yeah. yeah. I mean, well, you could have moved Batman a little bit more to the right. Don't talk about Justin. Uh, Jeff, no, I know, but would, instead of moving him in the background, move Batman to the right a little bit, and it'll still give you. Yeah, that and that would still give you that balance. Yeah, that yeah. that that triangle. Yeah. All right. Moving on. Anyone to hit? Man. Yep. Yeah. Good stuff. No, it's a good shot. I mean, the lighting. That, the lighting's on point. It just threw us, threw us for a loop. Look at yeah. this man, a new old man, and this is a totally different thing for him. And Trevor's not here. Okay. Always. Whenever he experiments and gets outside of his comfort zone, does something for Trevor. <laughs> Trevor can't be bothered to show up. He's like dead at the Trevor time. Trevor needs to get some rest. <laughs> I yeah, know. Like, I like picking on him. Watching him. In the, in the, uh, we love Trevor after. here. We just, I just like to pick on him because I get he's, a lot of. The, Trevor's the, the crop master. <laughs> yeah. But I had it in hand. This is a dope shot, man. Dude, this it's is more like before they took away his hair. Oh, don't get me started. <laughs> don't get me started. Do not get me started. We're here to talk about the photo, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Be the ball, man. Be the ball. No, 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 no. But um, I, I just think the lower part of the frame where it's dark before it goes up to the actual floor, he could have cropped that in a little bit. Yeah, See, I was going to say that. Below it right there. Yeah. See that black bar across the bottom? Yep. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's 
still really high too. You don't even need a lot of this. I mean, what purpose is that serving? See, yeah. I would have, I would have had like, a but I wouldn't have cropped it too low either, because then it would have looked kind of weird. So I don't know where to go with that. See, I would have put a sentinel head in the back, like if he had a sentinel or even an image of a sentinel, it could have been a cutout or whatnot, and just put it in the back, right there where the piece of um, wall is uh, damaged, just to kind of give an infant's that a uh, 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 a sense of him hiding. But then again, the way he's posed, it looks like he's in one of those moments where he's going mad because of the sinister. Oh yeah, yeah, he's mad. Yeah. He's definitely mad. You can tell. Yeah. You can see the crazy eyes right there, man. He's got the crazy eyes. No, 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 no. That's not crazy eyes. That's that's not. I'm tired. I want to sleep. Being more that's crazy eyes, man. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, look, it was Trevor. Very nice shot, but points off for morph. Morph. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I didn't like any of the X Factor crew, to be honest with you. No, no, in the comic, in the in the cartoon, he's an X Man. <laughs> I know, but he started out as an X Factor. I didn't that's know he, that's why he died in the first cartoon. episode. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> no, man, I appreciate you making this effort and going this far, man. I'm digging this, man. I really, I that's really a, am. Yeah, his leg is always Heck on yeah. point. So, I mean, yeah, really, oh, I like the crazy eye, regardless of what Lou says. Moving <laughs> on, man. Moving yeah. on. Thank what, you for what? thank you for. Ooh. Participating, oh, hey. uh, Alf, bleh, this guy, the Alpha Raptor CZ. Um, dude, man, she's like jumping, she's she's like getting away. Does she know where she's gonna land at? Is that Julianne Moore's character? I think so. I mm -hmm. think so too. Oh, local Luke came and left. Yeah, my um, left and came, I okay. kicked off. Oh, damn it. Yeah, I'm still here though. All right, we're back, Trevor. What do you think? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, I, I'm I'm digging the concept here, but I don't like how dark it is down here. Like this makes it all like the this light should be creating a rim around this on 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 the top and bottom. We're kind of outlining this whole bike almost, given how bright this looks. Like giving a nice break off of this backdrop. And then uh, I kind of feel like this is too close. I would want this further back, like she's made a bigger jump of it because something about the angle she's jumping and the way all this works doesn't seem to quite sit right. What do you guys think? Um, yeah. Less of a ledge to make it seem more intense, like there's more distance between the ledge and the bike to give it a little bit more. I see what you're saying. That makes sense. <clears throat> it just looks uh, too tight. Like, like there's, there's, yeah. there's it yeah. needs more room. Less of the ledge and the raptors hanging a little bit more on the thin part of the ledge and her a little further, you know, give her some space between them. That would that would make sense. I mean, you could put some kind of, I know they're in like in a forest or something, but some kind of motivated lighting from the bottom. But your point to the moonlight is 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 good with the, yeah, yeah. With the bike. There should be a, a halo around the bike a bit, you know. Yeah, a little bit of a rim light <laughs> on it. Yeah. But um, and and uh, I think what he's going. I mean, I, I I got an idea that they're going for you know, how close of a call it is. Like she's barely getting away, and that's kind of why yeah. it's so tight. But mm -hmm. I think there's other ways you could have done it, like maybe having one of the, I don't know, maybe it's a limit the posability, but having like a raptor screeching to a halt, like it's about to run off the cliff and it stopped itself. That gives you an idea that it came really close. Um, the other one kind of running into it or something. Um, just play around with it, you know, but this is just, I'm getting claustrophobic. Um, you keep talking about it. Actually, you know what? Yeah, keep, I may have a shot. Are you, are you playing with something? Uh, no, just keep talking. If I can find my shot that I did with the Raptors, similar to that. Oh, oh, okay. Keep talking. So there's one time at band camp. <laughs> this one time at band camp. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got, I got, I got, I got, I got, I got something. I got some. I can do it. I can do it. Enough! You are all of you beneath me. I am a god, you dull creature. I, I am. am. I'm not gonna I play am. that. Are you ready? Are you ready? No, keep going, man. Just keep Damn talking. it. All right. Go to the next shot. Well, go to the next shot. Yeah, we can go to the next shot. If I find whatever, then oh, I can always well, we talk about it. Oh, we got here. Ooh, damn. Oh, that's cool. That is cool. Oh, I like like those tracks. Yeah, the lighting's awesome, mm -hmm. too. Where's the Stegosaurus? Oh, that's that's really? Stegosaurus? That's the... Um... No, that's not a Stegosaurus. That's a, a Dimatron. No, no, no. Dimatron. Dimatron. Dang it, I can't even read it. Diamtrodon. There we go. Diatrodon? Yeah, oh. 
Yeah. Mm. Nice. Yeah, I know. I I was reading it, but I didn't know how to pronounce it because the word looks weird. Dime Trodon. Somebody it doesn't look weird. It doesn't look like it flows. Doesn't even look like Latin. It looks weird. Some of these figures have been translated into um like a Hammond Collection style, where they have more articulation. I think this is a Hammond Collection one, though. Th that is a Hammond Collection, though. I think so because, I, they, they... because I saw a couple on Amazon, and I'm looking for you know stuff for you know my my guys. So because oh. I ain't gonna lie, JP <laughs> Rex and the rest of you guys who are taking dinosaur pics, you know. You're making me want to grab some of these guys and kind of put it in this kind of barbaric, uh, reptilian, anthropomorphic world that I have. Where you hear that, guys? You're making Lou want to grab it. Whoa, whoa, whoa! No, but whoa. keep in mind, but keep in mind though that you have to look for it under the the Hammond collection because there is one of this <laughs> in the regular Jurassic Park line that has that little rib, uh, like act, battle um, damage. Yeah, that battle damage. Yeah, yeah, that's the one I saw. That I was like, no, 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 that that's not it. Yeah, no, there's a. I think this is the Hammond Collection one because the Hammond Collection does have this dinosaur no, also. Not. But let me let me welcome JP Ryder first, aka Warforge. Hey, JP. folks, just got home from work. Hope you're all having a killer day, friends. Also, where is Trevor? We <laughs> ate him. We fed him to this Dimatron. <laughs> Dimatrodon. Uh, and then JP Rex is chiming in about his Dimatrodon. He says, This is a mainline one. Don't like the oh. Hammond one of this species. The proportions are kind of weird. Oh. So I there, you well, there you go. And then there Eddie thinks I'm funny. Thank so you. cool. Thank see, you, Eddie. See, I, I don't mind the weird proportions because anthropomorphic, you know, we got a T-Rex with bigger arms and shorter legs, which makes no sense. Um, so you know, it would fit with what, what I'm trying to do. But thank you for the info. Appreciate it. But this yeah. shot is dope. I like the atmosphere on it. I like the lighting on it. You get to see uh, what's going on. It looks like he's just waiting for his next uh to come across the tracks. <laughs> Just Jeff says, looks like a dinosaur to me, fella. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with you. I'm with you on that, Jeff. It looked like Bubble Set to Mike. Boba, that's what I said. It looked like Bubble Set. <laughs> What's up, Pinsy Picks? How you doing tonight, buddy? Good to What's see you. On? Good to see it's you. Just another Boba Fett. It's just another I, man I, Boba Fett day. I think the only thing I might have done, I, I, I might have added, I mean, I get the story. I, I might have added another. Uh, yeah. another light on the camera. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. I think so. Just, just to add some like tunnel interest or something from where the tracks or, or something like that, or some, some, just a small bounce to the other side. Um, yeah, because there's there's a lot of rock there. There's just a lot of rock and and um. Well, this could be a scene from a movie. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, could, yeah, it could be. He does that. He does. I mean, that I don't know. I mean, it could be. Um, I doubt it is, but it could be. Uh, Controversial Toys, a.k.a. Casper, says, it's a dinosaur. It can be whatever size you want it to be. If you're happy, that's all that matters. And that's that, true. Caleb I don't even know how the dinosaurs look, man. Caleb collects you know? 98. Yo. Oh, never mind. My shot's not anywhere. All right, we're going to move on then. JP Rex, man, thank you for having feathers. All right. Oh, Doughboy snaps and claps, apparently. Hey. Claps and Ooh. snaps. Snaps and claps. Wait, wait, wait. Is this the 112 scale? Yes. Yes. Yep. It's the, the, is it in our? No. Not in our, no, uh, no, no, no. No, it is not. It's that third <laughs> part. Yeah, no. I, I'm getting confused. Uh, the, Flix Toys, isn't it? Who makes it? Flix? Flix? No. It starts with an M. Uh, well, they didn't tag the mofos. I don't know. What, what, my toy? No, my toy shots. I don't know. I thought it started with an M. I, I could be wrong. I can't think of the name right now. It'll come to I me. I thought it was Flex Toys. I thought they were the only ones that made the 12 scale. Uh, 12 uh, figures, the 12 world style. Like, you know, they did the um, miniature versions of the Hot Toys, um, Green Goblin, Doc Ock, uh, Snake Eyes, and Storm Shadow. Like, that that type of style of uh, doing toys. Like It just shrunk a Hot Toys figure. Well, it's a Lucy inspired by a scene. Okay, JP. Thank you. Uh, Warforged says, I remember reading somewhere the first bones discovered of ancient monkeys, the, the tails people thought it was a stinger. Hmm. Oh. Um, what's bugging me the most, I mean, well, let's start off with saying I like the colors. I, I, I like the colors here. 
Um, I, of course, the pose is a classic pose, but there something kind of irking me. He's not quite sitting on his bench. He's like, I see what you're saying. Yeah, he's yeah, not. The, the, he's hunched over, kind of funny. Uh, Seth says muff toys. Muff toys. There, that's who I was thinking. Yeah, muff toys. Yep. Thank you. And, and of course, you can see it here really well, but he's not actually sitting on anything. And then here, you can tell he's not sitting on. I mean, he's got this piece of foam or whatever propped up on two pieces of something to make it look like a a bench a bench but you know so maybe that's why but he really needed to probably solidify that seat because it looks weird that he's not sitting like yeah i would just put him to sit down and if he has like an issue of balancing or... uh, right thank you toy mirth felix is what i meant not flicks uh okay. muff didn't make a joker <laughs> oh I thought it was, oh okay Never mind. Then I thought it was. I was right. I just said Flix, and it was supposed to be Felix. Uh, yeah, Felix does. Yeah. Oh, I guess it is the same one that did the other Joker then too. Okay. That's what I meant. Felix also did the ink blot, didn't they? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Um. Anyway, sorry. Continue. Yeah. So, um, I would have, you know, I don't know if he was worried about creasing the pants, but once it gets like that, you start getting creases regardless. But put the um the tush of the freaking figure down or at least his thighs and uh work on that angle that you want to create the illusion because right now we can't see the illusion because he's not actually sitting down so casper suggests that maybe it's so he could fit within the, the you know, box. this still doesn't make any sense even if that, he would actually fit in there better <laughs> yeah like if he sat down he will fit better or if that's the case change the angle that your your perspective your um subjects on rise the the bars raise the bars up so that way we can actually see if not cut off the waist completely because yeah, it looks like he's over. doing this hi boys how you doing yeah. Yay. that's a good boy oh <laughs> boo boo oh boo boo oh boo boo Sorry. Yeah, I mean, I can see that, but it, 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 on that shot, if he would have gone a little higher or it didn't show that he was leaning that, it would have, I think he would have gotten away with it. Yeah, this is the lean is, is just kind of awkward. Just Yeah. And unfortunately, you could see it. Yeah, I mean, I can't take my eyes off it. I can see that he's leaning forward. He's not sitting down, even in this main shot. Even oh. if you, since we're not, you, you were going to cut it off, crop it there anyways, you could have still had him. Sitting on his bottom with his feet, mm -hmm. even if his feet were up, it was still would have given him the illusion that he was sitting down. Yeah. yeah. And then the Trevor pops in, you know, of course, <laughs> trying to do his best to be here. Are you saying he muffed the pose? I never <laughs> heard that term for a pose. No, he smurfed the pose. He smurfed. The pose. There you go. I like that. I like that. Um, <laughs> anyway, let's give that a like and uh, let's move on. Thank you so much, Go Boy Snaps. Let's move on. Oh, the Bronx bat. And uh, we got um, Bruce Lee, and I don't know who that is. Um, but he's about to hit the gong. He's on the gong show this week. That's yeah, an old that show. show. Yeah, right? Yeah, the gong show. Gong show, man. Mike and I, we're old. Gosh, Trevor <laughs> knows it, too. He's a, he's older. And I think I'm older. I'm... <clears throat> um, as as I'm this one's a better one. I mean... You're still able to cast the shadows in the wall, so you know you're pretty close to the wall. But in this kind of shot, it's not as bad as like when you have like a wall that's got its own shadow effects in it, and you you're highlighting it with light. So this is not as bad. This is actually working out fairly well. But the figures are a little dull. Their light is not quite that. Yeah, I, I, I get that. You know, they're on stage doing a performance kind of vibe. You know, every oh, there's multiple lights. You see a couple of shadows bleeding off to each other. And uh, they're just gonna hit that gong, baby. It's just gonna hit. Welcome to the gong show. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you know. yeah. I think I would have brought it away from the wall a little bit to soften that shadow up, and then yeah, and then leveled out the horizon line a little bit. It's 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 got a weird angle to it. The I don't know if that was intentional, Look. but. But the the line where the floor meets the wall is is crooked, and then the sign on top is angled the other way. So I I might level it all out just a little bit. <clears throat> I see that. I see that. I see what you're saying. But 
but uh, with the black hair of, of Bruce Lee and the black hair of the girl, they they blend a little bit into the yin yang part of the black, and so I might try to separate that just a little bit. Yeah, I was with the uh, yeah, with a little with a little uh, some sort of soft material you could shoot that uh, looked like your your light was well right in the front, really if front and kind of a little bit high. You could tell on the on the gong, on, not on the gong, but the gong banger, whatever you call shoe. it. On the gong uh, banger, uh, and so I, I might have just uh, shot through something, so some sort of uh, diffusion material to spread that light out just a little bit, maybe. And, yeah, yeah, soften and then, up. yeah, and then move her a little bit more forward, so her black hair is more in the white side of the, the um, the yin yang, so she stands out a little bit more because uh, there's, so yeah. she doesn't blend so much into the wall. But that's all. Yeah, good all right. stuff. Good stuff. Yeah. Good stuff, Bronx Bat. Thank you so much. And uh, for and now, I'd like to take a moment to uh, to uh, get a word from our sponsors. And uh, <laughs> so, uh, I, I wanted to show off this real quick because I, I made some modifications to my sideshow crow before my shot today. Oh, Solomon and, Kane, and look at him! I uh, I added some bullet shells. <laughs> <laughs> this is better than Solomon Kane. Um, I know. I added some bullet some bullet shells to his hair. Because in the comic books, he tied 357 magnum shells in his hair. What did you use for the shells? Is that actual, like, the um, ones? Or I, I, I actually painted some little bits of toothpick. And then I glued them to a push pin and pushed it through the hair and cut the end of the push pin off. So it wasn't hitting the head sculpt or anything else. That way I'm not gluing anything to the hair. The, pin, the pinholes you won't even see. And, uh, yeah, I mean. Oh, and also tied a little bit of black cord around the uh you know to make it look like his hair is tied around it some show would tell so oh you see he like he took the back out well i was showing the 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 tie uh right on there's a little black black uh ties that i use for the hair okay nice this is oh look look, crow man this is this is the figure man this is the sideshow crow i vote for this over the hot toys crow really yes i have both i like this one better well, I vote that you grab one of these bad boys. What is? Oh, that's the compendium. Yeah, it might not have all the extra chalk skis, but it has more um, issues in it because of the Mirage comics. Um, Kevin Eastman and Peter Lev felt that the artists who worked on the comics that's their comic, even though it's their characters. Okay. So I need to probably pick that up. I haven't read the original books in forever. How many issues that go through? One through what? This collects. I want to say, I should say right inside of it. Um, yeah, I saw the director. Uh, and good evening, Turner. All right, I guess Pablo's got the buttons. What's up, Turner. What's up, Paul? All right. Uh, TMNT issues one through seven, nine through fourteen. Um, what happened to eight? That's what I was saying. Some are still, you know, belong to certain individuals. Some issues belong to certain individuals. It, mm. It's it's weird how Mirage did it, but um, people are asking if they could do a Kickstarter so we can get those issues out in a single run so we can add it to the collection. And um, is Raphael number one not in there? Because the uh, go 10 is, and Casey Jones is in issue 10, reading, right? I'm still reading it. Remember, this is a thick book. One through seven and nine through 14. Um, Fugitoid issue one. Hold on, uh, Raphael. Um, issue one. All right, so it's got the first series. Casey Jones in there. Good, Angelo, Michael Series, Donatello, Michael Series, uh, Leo, and right. Tales of the TMNT issues one through five. Rock on, rock on. Nice. All right, rock back, man. Thanks so much for sharing that. We're gonna move on now. Uh, Casper, oh. man, we got some oodles and noodles of Ghostbusters spaghetti. Oh. Did you I remember the shot. This is an older one, but uh, you know we're just getting out get, get to it. This is a month old now. Wow. Hey, listen, it, 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 it busted makes you feel good regardless of what time of the year it is. Yeah, I'm just glad he didn't use the Mezco ones because you know this looks like we could have messed up some years. <laughs> uh, it makes me feel good. I remember that. Yeah. You remember that, right? <laughs> Boston definitely makes me feel whole good. different, different, whole so different meaning nowadays. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a whole different meaning for that term nowadays. But yeah, yeah. yeah. Maz, what's the issue with the the Mezco ghost? But they're fine. I don't have an issue. I wouldn't want to make a mess on him with this spaghetti. I mean, he uses spaghetti but here. But, but there's no spaghetti on the Ghostbusters, though. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. I mean, it's only on Slimer. It's only on Slimer. Look, man, I don't like that kind of filth near my figures. <laughs> no, no, and as you... long as it's al dente, it's okay. It's when it's cooked all the way. <laughs> so, it, 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 from what it looks like, it looks like it's it's dried out. 
It looks like yeah. a dry spaghetti to begin with. Yep. And how dare you use that that generic brand, man? You need the, yeah, the Barcelona or whatever the book. Bar- yeah, yeah. Why would you want to mess up the good brand on a Photoshop when you can eat the good brand? Because I wouldn't buy the bad brand either, either way. I just my habit would be grabbing the blue box, not this blue box. <laughs> Two pennies for Dish, the sh- the or whatever it is. I'm gonna use it. <laughs> Hey. All right, all right. TJ in the house, man. What's up, TJ? How you doing? Uh, R three toys in the house. How you doing, buddy? How you doing? Um, and then Eddie, you were asking about my stoke for the new crow. No, no, oh, yeah. I think they need to just leave well enough alone. Anyway, moving on uh, to the picture. I like the lighting here, Casper. Like, I... It's pretty nice. It's very bright though. Like the whole scenes are kind of bright. Yeah. Like there's. I think that off topic real quick, if that new crow, if it wasn't Eric, I, I wouldn't have minded. Dude, it, it doesn't feel like a crow movie. I'm sorry, guys. Well, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, tangent real quick. That's what I'm saying. If it wasn't if it wasn't based on Eric, it would have been fine. If it was a new crow, like a new person that got on the power of the crow, because uh-huh. the Eric wasn't the only crow to begin with. Man, it just exactly. feels like a generic story that they did. It feels like when I watched the trailer, I felt like I was watching like five other movies I've already seen. Well, yeah, but but again, if it wasn't if it wasn't Eric, if the character's name was not Eric, if it was just a new crow person, another person that took on the mantle yeah, as a crow, so. it would have been fine. But the yeah. fact that they're kind of rebooting it and it's Eric again, that's where they kind of screwed up. They should have just made him a new a new crow, a new person that got the crow power. Didn't they bastardized the music, man. <clears throat> yeah, they did the great job in the original show. They they were trying to go off the music because during the comic book. Sorry, we're on a tangent. I apologize. Yeah, I know. During the yeah, during the comic book, James R. Bar, o. Bar he, he quoted songs like a lot of them were Joy Division songs, which is why they had Nine Inch Nails cover "Dead Souls" because Ian <laughs> is dead. Um, so there's no more Joy Division. Um, but you know that kind of that kind of music was in there, and then they bastardized it with, yeah, they tried to give you something with Ozzy Osbourne, but what was that auto tune shit at the end? I don't know even know what that no, was. But that was bad. This movie wouldn't bother me if it was. Another person that took on the crow mantle, like that's where they screwed yeah. up. I think they should have left Eric oh, no, alone no. and done a new, a new crow, like a new entity of the crow. That that would have been fine, and the music would have been fine in this new movie because it would have not messed with the original. <laughs> the fact that they're doing like a reboot, like pisses on the original one, which is kind of crappy. They should have done just. I think that's why Eric. Momoa didn't didn't end up making the other one. I think he probably said, "Hell with this." Right. Yeah. And you know, as much as I don't care for him. I, I would appreciate if he took that stance because when I saw that trailer, I just felt like I was watching some generic garbage. And I understand, like in the comic book, he's got this this the skeletal cowboy guy that kind of points him into some directions and stuff. And like they just gave you some human like I felt like you know that human like the guy who played Merlin in Excalibur that was in the Spawn movie. Yeah, I felt yeah. like that was like they really that. Yeah, and I was like, ugh. All right, but back to back to yeah. back to the photos. Yeah, yeah. That, that was yeah. Um, <laughs> Um, let's see they keep politics out. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Okay, yes, yes. Yeah. You, um, you guys could give it a chance. I'm not gonna give it my dollar. Um, I might give it some time, I but just, I'm not gonna give it my dollar. They all target. Yeah. Yes, yes. I'm sorry. Target. We're moving yeah. on. Yeah, Casper, cool. let's give you the undue attention you deserve. Well, that is great on this, Casper. This is was this for the noodle challenge? I'm assuming it was, right? Uh, yeah, this your Dirk's yeah. noodle challenge. Yeah, it's for Dirk's noodle challenge. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I need mm. to get into these challenges. Yo, problem. You gotta talk to me every now and then, bro. <laughs> Mike, talk to me every now and then. Let me know when these challenges well, happen. I, like to have I don't know when these challenges happen, well, man. Right I don't now, know where he posts these. Well, if you go to Sir Dork's oh, Instagram yeah. account on his stories, he has under with the next challenge. So right now, the next challenge by uh, before the end of this I month. I follow is, him. I never see his stories. The freaking you have to click on the stories. You have to click on it yourself. Click it's not gonna it. pop up. You have to, you have to click on it. It's it's it. Effort, man. It takes and, a little bit of effort. Stories he doesn't come up for me to click on. I'd have to go. No, to his account and yeah, click on. that's why you have to go to his Instagram and click on his little story thing. And on there, he has like four slides. It'll say the the new challenge name. When it's due and all that. So right now the current challenge is cute. So you have to have something cute in the shot. All right. Oh, I'm going to put Pablo on the shot. <laughs> so I'm going to put Pablo kissing his dog on the shot. Oh, yes. <laughs> my, my problem is I need to do the do the collabs. I see them all and I think, oh, I'm going to save that. And I'm going to do it. And then. Yeah, see, there's I a hashtag. Forget. The door cute is the next one. Then I yeah. forget. All right. All right. All right, let's move on. Casper, we need to go back to Casper. All right, so anything for Casper here? No, the lighting's great. I like the lighting. He's got enough overall lighting, and it's not hot anywhere. Yeah. Um, 
it just works. It works. It works. It's, it's it works. a nice shot. Especially for the theme of the channel. Everything's, everything's in focus that needs to be in focus, which is Slimer. Mm -hmm. That's the main point here. Mm -hmm. um, There's a lot of space in there. I, I might have some, some come in from the edges just a little bit, but I don't know. Yeah, it that like could work. Artistic thing. I mean, it looks it looks nice though. It looks really it looks it mm -hmm. looks good definitely. Straight up mm -hmm. story vibes just with Ghostbusters. I love. It. Yeah, M might might have had a couple of those guys like half half uh, squatted down or something or, or not all. You know. So now I'm looking up. for an Easter egg. Casper says that anybody knows the Easter egg. I don't see an Easter egg. You, you don't see the extra ghost in the back. This um, one here. Yep, there's another yeah. ghost. Is that, is that the Easter egg, or is it the actor one behind that, or is the ghost no. uh, uh, standing on the plate? There. I don't know. What's the Easter egg? Is there an egg? Is there a freaking Easter egg I'm looking for? I don't know. <laughs> Ask it over on the opposite side. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> All right, moving on, though. We've spent a lot of time here. Casper, yeah. thank you so much for sharing. Good, good shot. Um, ghost with the logo in the back. Yeah, in the back. Okay. This, hold on. This is a nice shot, Casper. This right here, Casper, bro. This is an overhead bro. shot. We don't even have Trevor here to talk about it, and he loves overhead shots, bro. guys. Bro, he this has badass. shots of this specific scene right here. He has overhead shot, uh, below oh, to one. top shot type of stuff. Yo, dude, this was fire. Mm -hmm. Look how they're all crouching. They're, like, they're watching them get in there and do their thing, and they're like, yeah, we're going to get you guys. The setup is, is, is very, very nice because you got the foot soldiers – uh, kind of ransacking the the uh, turtle van, which is a straight, straight, straight rip from the first mission in Shredder's Revenge. Mm -hmm. But you see the turtle van getting hijacked, getting by hijacked, the yep. and they're coming out of the uh, uh, Channel Six News um, station, the station, to, yep. to, to, to round two. So like, is the end of the first one? You go into the second one, and you're like, motherfucker. <laughs> And you start beating up everybody. <laughs> Look, Lou, I want to I want to take this chance and and say, Casper, I, it may have been a year since you posted your first picture, but man, have you grown leaps oh, and hell yeah. that year? Look at this yep. compared to what Casper posted when he first started. Man, I mean, remember when he first started? We were like, "What the hell are you doing?" <laughs> <laughs> well, he was, a, he was using a lot of filters. Yeah, yeah, he, he was, was like, "Let's that. throw this up and throw that." Just whatever sticks is like throwing spaghetti at the wall. It's done. Um, but he's no, come, yeah, he's come a long but way. Damn, this is this is awesome, Casper. I'm so glad to be a part of this. I'm so glad to see see you, you know, come such such this way, man. I'm just so mm -hmm. happy. So so yeah. so happy. But let's give that little like button there. Boop. Yeah, gotta um, hit the like button. Like, well, I'm on my other account, which I don't really go no, look. No, 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 stuff, no, I get you. No, 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 I get you. But I'm just saying, anyone else who's watching the stream that hasn't, oh uh, yeah, oh yeah, like button on that. Okay. Here, man. Look just at that. Just do it. Just do it. <laughs> I was channeling my inner uh my inner, inner, wrestler. <laughs> inner wrestler. No, no, uh the Frax's name, Go, uh, Transformers, uh the actor Constantine, uh what the hell? Keanu Reeves? No, the other oh, one. The other one. <laughs> you know, the annoying kid. Um the annoying <laughs> Shia LaBeouf? Thank you. Everybody did that. Just do it. God, I could not think of that boy's name, man. Oh man. All right. Anyway, moving on. Casper, this is this is just awesome. In fact, Casper, Casper, this this is just for you. This is just for you today. More deep. Russell no longer needs the wizarding module. Look at that. Edit it just for you and everything, man. Just just for you, Casper. That's beautiful. And another shout out to Casper for joining me and the rest of us at Half Shell. Yeah. Thank nice. you. Thank you so much. Casper kicking it, man. He's kicking it. Hey, why don't you go you know camp around on that old stream link? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, I mean, I mean oh, that's... <laughs> Dang. all right. Ooh. Yeah. Gabriel. Dude. Yeah. Gabriel. I'm just gonna live on this button, man. I'm just gonna live on this. <laughs> Deep. Russell no longer needs the wizarding module. I love that bit. He got tired of the rabbit not getting his cereal. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, no, man. no, no, no. Look, look, he got his katana right there. Yep. And they say tricks are for kids, and look who's on the floor. Yep, exactly. That's what I'm saying. He no. got tired of the white rabbit not getting look, the cereal. Hasn't he? Isn't this a repost? I, I could swear I've seen this picture before. We saw this picture because it was posted for uh, a turtle a collab uh, a few months ago. That's why you okay. saw it. Okay. 
That is dope. That is dope, man. That is so dope. I, like I can't say nothing to that. That that, that, you know? that brow look, that look through the brows he's got mm-hmm. right there. He's just kind of looking up at you, like you got something to say. You got, you right? got yeah. this conversation? He's not even showing teeth yet. He's like, I'm gonna give you the look. I don't even. Would you me. like to know more? <laughs> Would you like to know more? <laughs> no, no, no. He's holding the spoon. He's I'm like, gonna get that clip. Oh. Would you like to know more? No, no, no. He's holding the spoon, going, "Want some?" Like you ought to get that clip from Starship Troopers. <laughs> Do you want to know more? <laughs> you want Going to the know- fight, blah blah blah. That would be some great, great places to get some clips from. Yep. No, but this is a dope shot, Gabriel. I need a good one for some hands. I was thinking about like a just a like a twenty second clip of everybody getting slapped by people, just slap, 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 slap. But I couldn't think of who would be slapping who. Well, there's that one. Yeah, just the one. Everybody one. slaps themselves. Like. No, there's that one. It, it well, it was. Going around a lot on TikTok a while back of that one guy slapping the kid, and then the parents come. It's like you can't hit my kid, and he slaps the parents. And oh the yeah, come there, he slaps yeah. the cops, and he slaps everybody yeah. at the party, and he walks yeah. out like a boss. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was hilarious. Airplane, yeah, airplane. Everybody hit their heads like that. <laughs> That's right. Airplane, yeah. Oh, this is a dope shot. I gotta definitely do the one where he's pulling off the glasses. We're gonna do airplane with it. Don't call me Shirley. <laughs> <laughs> Surely, don't call me Shirley. Roger, Roger. Uh, Gabriel, this I oh, gotta love this shot. I remember yeah, the really lighting's awesome. Here, man. So so awesome. There's nothing yeah. bad to say about it. We only could give it praise. So yeah. we have to go next. Yeah, we gotta keep moving. Yeah, 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 we gotta keep going. Yeah, this shot. All right, Gabriel, thank you so much, man. Oh, look at this. More Gabriel love, man. Love this. this is I'm gonna sing the doom song now. Doom 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 doom. doom and I like that he put the cutout of of uh Gur? Gur or somewhere yeah. in here. Remember that? Yeah, he's up there, he's in the top uh, right behind the roll, right on uh, right Herbie. On Herbie. Yeah, he's writing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's singing the doom song. Doom, 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 doom. <laughs> I still wanted to do this, and I was so mad to see that he did it first, man. Because uh, <laughs> I started when I first opened this, the the freaking figure, I was singing this doom song to myself. Like, doom, 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 doom. <laughs> doobie, 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 doom, 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 doom. Who did with that? We need some action figures from that cartoon. Man. I <laughs> have Zim. one, but he fell over and w- Zim's eye broke, and I, I oh. could Photoshop it so it wouldn't look broke. But yeah. So what you looking for? A, huh? Huh? You looking for a Zim Maz? Uh, well, yeah. I might look over at the toy toy night. I might find a Zim. All right, yeah. but if I see anything out here, I'll let you know. I have a Zim, but like I said, he fell over because he was on a stand thing, and he fell off the shelf, and his eye like broke a chip like right up here. Yeah. Um, but I don't have a girl that goes with them either. So yeah. All right. So. But yeah, you remember my old name was Invader Maz. I mean, I was, Invader Maz. I yeah. Yep. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, another uh, dope Gabriel, man, again, dude, I'm not gonna play the mode deep thing again because I think everybody's getting sick of it. I don't yeah, know. it was back to back already. So yeah, yeah back to back already, man. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> you deserve it for this one too. I'm just saying. Uh, Gabriel, thank you so much. Beautiful work. Dude, look at Clone Wars, man. Superman having a pot noodle Bombay bad boy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's cool, man. That's pretty cool, man. I think this is a Sir Dork challenge. Yeah, Sir yep, Dork. Yeah, challenge. it's a Sir Dork. Yep, the noodle shot. The... That's pretty okay, dope. Okay, so we're using the little thing there. Oh, and a little candle inside the noodles. All right. Oh, what? where was that in the picture? I didn't see <laughs> it, that in the it, picture. It, it is in the picture. What are you talking about? The flame in the picture? It's oh, right yeah, there. It, is, isn't it? it just it looked more alive. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, it's a <laughs> need some red glow on his face, though. I mean, you got a little bit, but it's not any high points to it. You need like a, a, a hotter, like not red, red, but like a highlight, like a whitish, <laughs> something to bring some highlights in there from that beam and the fire. That fire should be lighting them right up. Yeah. Um so all his front should be lit up really well with some uh, warm light. But uh, I mean, it's great, inventive, very inventive. Yeah. I like this. Mm-hmm. Um, it's a dope shot. But uh, yeah. and of course, if you don't want to burn your new Mezco figure. You're pretty close to that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you took it away. Okay, yeah, you moved him back in. Gotcha. You guys got anything? No, I think doing all the talking. I'm gonna need. No, more. no. Well, you, you, you pretty much said about the the red. A little bit more red and yeah, white. This whole back face. scene should be lit pretty well. Like this, I mean, given how close everything should be, there's this shouldn't be dark over here either. It should have a warm glow to like the whole area. Well, I mean, it depends because sometimes when a burst of fire, it absorbs all that light and it, it gets dark all around. 
What horror movie? Yeah. Are you watching? Oh man, I've blown plenty of stuff up, man. All right, fine, <laughs> fine. We <Hopefully laughs> disagree on that. I mean, it could be a vacuum. It could be just light. <laughs> Right, moving on, Clone Wars, man. This is this is cool though. I like this a lot. Thank you so much. Ooh, Turtle Toy Fanboy. Dang. Look at Leo ain't having it. He's got this one foot. This one foot's choking, and the other foot's like, no, please, please, no. Whatever you do, no. I won't. I won't. Just... <laughs> what did I walk into? My... <laughs> no. Oh man, this is nice. It is nice. I like. I, I like the angle. That is shot at the the focal point the way it is like it's yeah the only the only thing I'm gonna touch on like I agree I like the lighting I like I like the scene but I probably would have blue tacked his head because I don't like the angle of the head on Leo it's a bit weird I probably would have tried some blue tack to kind of get more of a, a oh, different God. angle on that oh, no that, no you don't even have to do that that head and that neck will give him that. That articulation hold on, to look hold on, down. Hold on, hold on, I got him right here. Let me, let me see something. You should yeah, have you. Can he look down that shoulder a bit more? Because I don't like the way his head's popped up. Uh, he could look a little bit more now, but it's in an angle. So. Yeah. See, I would have gone with so I could attack it and and had him more over the shoulder and still looking down. Because having him look up like this, but put his went... head over the shoulder, like, yeah. like well, parallel with the shoulder. No. Well, no. Back. I can wait a second. You can make me pull mine out, aren't you? You're, no, no, you get him on there. Because he he's in this angle right here where he could. This is how far as he could go down. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. See, uh, you know what? For some reason, I thought he had that extra ball joint on the neck. No, this is NECA we're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot NECA that. Has the ball joint, but they don't have the clearance. It's too much. Um... Yeah, yeah. I would. No, I but, um, but I'm talking about. Uh, I'm talking about in the lower part of the neck. They don't have the double. I would have put his he pulled his head off and made it lower on his body and had it looking over that shoulder. You would have to remove the entire peg. Yeah, it would be a blue tax, you know, yeah. thing. It would yeah. have to be. But I, I would have gone with that because just I mean maybe maybe I'm just weird, but I I, I feel yeah, like his head looks kind of like his angle looks uncomfortable the way he's turned here. Well, what um, I would have done is turned um the body of Leo a little bit more and extended the arm. And had the sword like you know tilting it just to avoid it, so it's like it will look more like this. Hold on, let me use the camera again. It, it will look more like this with the sword pointing at him. And have the other arm out that way, yeah. That, that could have worked too. But I would have yeah. done. I would have been the more difficult way and play with blue tech because you know that's that, I like to make life more difficult. I don't want to really take mine out. But can you? Can his? Can his head tilt back? Like this way? Yeah. You guys make this is as far as I can go. Oh, okay, no, there. Because I was gonna say, if if we can, if you could have done that on, weird, Lou. like, on, Lou. where he has his head tilted back and looking down, like this is this is how yeah, that's, go back and that's how and that's how he has it on the shot, actually. Yeah. Right so yeah. so to create the the illusion, though, you know, bring it a little bit forward, <laughs> look down, have him point out yeah. like this, and then extend this arm all the way out, kind of like a where are you going. You know yeah. what I mean? I'll have to look at him just because he's not looking at him anyway. So yeah. it's one of those. But um, still a great shot, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a great um, shot. What I would do, though, is I would get rid of all the junk that you see that's there. Like, I see, like, the shopping bag, uh, soda cups, and uh, what is it, the newspaper. It, it's kind of like, I know it's trying to fill up the angle. Wrong toy, Maz. I know, but this is the one I already had. I already blue tacked his head on there. See, so I was just saying, you can get get that more. You get more of an angle that you want. Yeah, that's the wrong one. I know it's the wrong one, but you can get the angle you want without having so much neck. If you do the blue tack thing like that, see. Yeah, but even even that toy has a different. A it's neck not gonna be exact. I know that, Lou, but I'm just giving them the illustration. I know. What, I'm just what I'm you. talking about. <laughs> 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 but um i like the use of the phone booth um on the side yeah i do not believe that phone booth um has like a proper uh base or stand it's like being held up by something else because there's a pizza box there kind of cleverly like hiding yeah, it's, it. it's i think it's the one that came with the accessory pack if it's the one that came with the accessory pack you could easily uh blue tack that to one of the uh cardboards and have something hold up the cardboard without uh interfering with uh it falling over. 
Mm. You know what I mean? Um, I think that's the one that comes with the accessory pack. I don't know. I gotta double. I don't shot. know where it comes from, man. It just come from the sky. Nah, because I would this like. This is no shot though. Uh, yeah, it's a good shot. Yeah, the lighting is awesome. Blue. I yeah. like the lighting. I love that blue light coming from the back on the camera right. I think he's got great. a really great shot. But like I said, it's just the weird angle of the neck is driving me nuts. Other than that, I like this a lot. I, I don't mind the, the pose it's of the head. Too bad. Yeah. Not too bad, but um, it could be a little bit better. But he's using... um Sticky dog. Using, hold up. He's not using the traditional Leonardo sword from what I what it looks like. It looks like that's the last Ronin uh sword. Yeah, because of the gold yeah. um yeah. Hilt, or the gold uh whatever the, I can't think it of it was the right figure. Ha ha <laughs> it's the Suba. Yeah. Sticky dots turtle toy fanboy. This is his shot by the way so he didn't have to shut up. Uh last Ronin is correct. See see yeah yeah so nice. I wasn't wrong pulling that figure out. It did have some bearing on the conversation after all. <laughs> just the sword. Just hey, the sword. Hey, it had, as he'll, just said, he'll take whatever he can. Thing. <laughs> he'll it take had, whatever he all can. Theory, all Moss needs is a little confirmation. Yeah. Just, 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 just a little. Just, just a little. Taking the wind. As it should be raining outside the doorway. <laughs> yeah, we go again. <laughs> all right, moving on. Turtle Toy Man, this is, this yeah, is, this is a dope shot, I do man. like this. Yeah, man. Thank you so much for sharing that. Good looking shot. We're gonna move on. Ooh, Ooh. dope boy snaps with a little Damn, alien eating an eyeball. Is that, eyeball? Eyeball? Nice. <laughs> is oh, that cool. the eyeball from the super action stuff? Yeah, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Because yeah. I remember, remember seeing this shot before on another stream, and yeah, yeah look at that. that's the runner alien, huh? Uh huh. I could never get the legs to do that. They just pop off before I do that. So I, I threw it away and cut its head off. You had a defective one. Yeah, I know. That's why I like my my resurrection aliens because they can Dang. get this pose. That looks mm -hmm. really dope. Look at that. Yeah. Although that, that extra little strand of slime slime could have been removed. I don't think he needed that. Yeah, yeah. it was necessary. It, it, that looks more like a, a strand of hair than than. The hair is right without there. it. That, that looks kind of better. Right there, yeah. That's the this, final. This part. is your winner right here, Dull Boy Snaps. This is this is really nice, man. Yeah. I like this one. I like it a lot. Yeah, I like it a lot. Nice job. Yeah. Good job, man. He's not a tumor. No, it's an eyeball. It's an eyeball. It's, an eyeball. <laughs> it's beautiful. I don't I think there's a lot that really add to it. I mean, you could possibly rim light them out some more on this side so you can pull them off this background a little bit. No, more. But, no. but you don't have to. I said possibly. I said possibly. I, I like the way it is because it, it because yeah. they've always they're always coming out of these dark areas. They're not always lit yeah. all around completely. Yeah, I know, I know. I shoot so, my aliens. Yeah. I know. I know. It's a lot. A right. lot. Moving but, on, go boy. Thank you so much. Oh, we got Batman. The dark matter know. art with uh, some nightmare Batman. He's having a nightmare. Boo hoo. Uh, okay. All right. Uh. Batman having a nightmare. That corner and the fence and the positioning of the figure just throws me off completely. Yeah, it's weird that this is going this way. This way. I could get, I could get with it. It's a nightmare. It's a dream sequence. It's it, like nothing makes sense. Well, Mike is all about weird angles and stuff, and like what's wrong with him. So tell us, Mike, what do you think? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, there's no feet I... here. Most of the hands are cut off. That's the only thing that I don't like is the hand. The fingers are cut off. Yeah, you could have you could have definitely swung it over a little bit to uh, move the camera, you know, turned it uh, to the right just a little bit. Yeah, swung it, baby, and, and that would have fixed that. I mean, I like the lighting. I, I get a really tungsteny, uh, you know, prison light sort of vibe to it. Um, so I mean, I, I, I there's a lot of texture to it. Yeah, the hand choice is a bit is a bit odd. You could have fixed that just for the simply turning the camera a little bit more right. Yeah, and uh, and that would have also took out a little bit more of that space up in the upper right. That's that's kind of empty. But I don't understand why this gate is going this way, and he's well, way this well way. you know, though. The, the, I he's mean, in the nightmare, though. he's in a dream state. Like it's the, a, the, it could I mean, be a rackety fence, and it's just leaning over. And he's, I mean, it could be a whole multitude of things. I guess there's no other real building or anything there to make it appear as though it has to be a straight piece of fence. Yeah. So, sure. you know, there's there's nothing there. It's, Showing that, so I don't really have a problem with it. But if you say, you know, I guess it gets a pass. I'm never oh, like right. it. it's cool. <laughs> now, if there was another building there that was straight up and down, maybe th then then that would make you question it. But since it's by itself, I I don't mind it. 
listen, it's like a hot dog. You question what's inside, and then some people are like, I know what's inside. I don't want it. As long as it's got sauerkraut, jalapenos, onions, and tomatoes, and I'm good. Mustard. Mustard. That's, that's all I need. Mustard? Yep. No ketchup? Gotta have it, man. No, nah, I don't need ketchup on there. Just mustard. Nah. I gotta have both. I gotta have both. The lighting's on point, though. Yeah, I like the lighting. It's great. Yeah. They really I like the goggles. It, they really give it a oh, nice mood. Yeah. Yeah. The goggles really reflect nice. Mm -hmm. You know. Like if you could really tell that the light's coming from above, whatever is wherever he's at, there's light mm -hmm. coming directly from above. It's, it's just me. It, it, below it. Jeez. His face, his face, his face looks weird these. though. Like his mouth. Yeah. His mouth, his expression looks weird. I don't ever never oh. I see this guy. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, yeah, it just looks weird. But good job. I think it's a fine I think it's a fine photo. Mm -hmm. Just the hand. Yeah, it's right. just the hand. Yeah. After the hand. hand. Gotcha. All right. Moving on. Thank you so much, Darth Matter Art. Yes. What we got next? We got Eddie and his toys. Oh. Come get some. Oh, okay. I he, he already got it. He already got it. It's berserk. Yep. What do you guys like for better? The first one? I like the first one. First Same one. Way. Yeah. First one. Yeah. First one. All right. Well, we got the hands in here, but no feet. But he's got it cropped at the right spot. So it's yeah. good. I can't tell what he's holding here, though, in this shot. He's he's not anything. That's his arm. He has an arm cannon hidden yep. in his, between his hand. That's his arm cannon. It's not a cannon. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I see what you're doing there. Funny man. Funny man. Oh, it's a it's it's a dope shot. I like the I like the yeah. composition for sure. The lighting works great on here too. The background yeah. with the orange and then the the nice little bit of blue on camera right, and it gives a little bit of that purple hue also. Yeah, and the and the embers the embers work pretty well. Hmm. All right, all right. Shut. Anything else? No? Nope. All right. Moving on. Eddie, thank you so much for your participation. Casper. <laughs> Kaba has got a slice of pizza. He's traveling in space. This is crazy. Don't drop the pizza. He dropped it. It's there. Pizza of the hunt. No, it's pizza. <laughs> Getting grease, pizza grease all down that console and inside the buttons, man. I know, man. What's the matter yeah. with you, man? I bet, I, bet this, I bet he takes this damn ship to go get repaired every time because it's like you can't, you can't understand why it's always breaking down. It's like, well, I wonder yeah. why. <laughs> pepperoni inside the buttons. Pepperoni. <laughs> oh man, no, this is a cool. It's a cool concept. Yeah, I think the lighting's a little too hot. I think the lighting's a little too hot on the on the on the background for the yeah. where he's going through light speed. I think that needed to be dialed. I, dialed back a little bit i mean i understand the light speed area being bright but the inside of the of the cockpit windshield whatever like that's too hot yeah i get what you're saying there should be some distinction just to mm -hmm. to create that depth yeah but other than that it, it's it's a great shot good angle also yeah. ludicrous speed go go <laughs> <laughs> all right <laughs> ludicrous speed yeah, this is now. Is now, then is now. Now is now. <laughs> well, what is he using as a uh, um as a panel? Is that a custom panel or is that from? No, like, I think it's from. Not... I, he had. There was another shot we saw of his that had a panel. Oh no, it wasn't his. It was someone else. But I think it's um, <laughs> Muppets Space Station or something. I think so. I don't know. Casper, are you still here, Casper? Casper. He'll let us know. Oh, that's right. Casper's not in. Yeah, we didn't let him in the back. That's right. We didn't let him in the back. <laughs> I was all like talking like he's in the chat, like in the channel. <laughs> no, nah, I was talking to him like he's in the chat. <laughs> all right. <laughs> well, while we wait on that. You want to keep moving? Yeah, that's a good shot, though. No, it's a good yeah. shot. Very yeah. nice. Stuff, Casper. Thank you. All right. What we got next? The Bronx Bat. This is your number three for today, man. Um, didn't we see this one already with that dog and the weird no. leg? We. No, not this one. Maybe a different yeah, one, but not he this one. readjusted. Maybe he readjusted. I, it's I a board it's game okay. part, I think. He's okay. he didn't even know what it's from. Damn. Hmm, interesting. Board game. Um I, 
everything just looks very flat here, Bronx. I mean, I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on it because it's your third one, but the same stuff we've been saying, you gotta you gotta be able to come off these walls and build some shadows with your lighting, not just a straight light. Um, yeah, same, same stuff. I'm, I am curious if he's just shooting with one light. Yeah, you, you just gotta play the angles in that light and get it to work and give you some some shadow too, because the shadow is gonna help create life. I mean, this is just very flat, very centric toy yeah. kind of the because the, the lighting is too even overall like yeah. it's just yeah. yeah there's no and again you're right on this wall so and it doesn't help that you have this bricked up fireplace and this same color wall because it feels like it's just a prop on top of a wall you don't really take note and say this is a different brick than than that or anything it's just you see gray gray and you're like yeah it's right on top of the wall so yeah Play around it, man. Props, Play around it. yeah yeah I like that you got the props. You got some going here, man. Just uh, work with the lights. Yeah. Let's get some lights going. Moving on, we got uh, Archer Hawk, man. Ooh. And uh, it looks like it, Will Smith has pumped up his game some. Um, <laughs> now that he didn't like the reviews of not being Robin Williams. Um, well, now, this is a dope uh, Mythic Legion Four Horsemen. Oh, oh, is this another mag magician thing? It's the, the genie. Uh, I forget the name of it. Mike, do you have this one? You need this one. No, I don't need Buy it. Buy it, Mike, right now. <laughs> no. I would actually get this because it's a genie and it fits anywhere. It doesn't matter where. Because, you know, it, it, it's supposed to transcend time and space, you know, type of thing. Oh. It's mythical. So, it's not a genie. I mean, wait. No, it is I, a genie. Yeah, the genie go against the, um, what the you wizards. call it? The Sun Wukong because it actually works well. Yeah. yeah. Or you put them against the wizards. Yeah. yeah, Jafar was a wizard. The genie kicked Jafar's butt by. Well, except uh, yeah. except in the Four Horsemen, and this is a, a bad guy. Yeah, exactly. That's why I said Sun Wukong got to put him. Yeah, because he's not he's well. We call a genie. He's a jinn, and jinn. Yeah, he's a jinn. Yeah, this is a jinn. Yeah, actually, a good genie. There's no such thing as a good genie. There's always like a monkey paw kind of thing. Yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like the frame of the doorway in this shot a little better, even though I, I do like some of the aspects of the tight crop. I do like being able to see the foot, where it's going, you because know, I'm with Mike on the foot one there this time. Especially since we're losing yeah. part of the body to the smoke. And that Yolanzi smoke is definitely, definitely That's right. doing it. That's right. Remember, <laughs> creates that mystique that the genie is go. coming up from the. Go figure, go. It is it's a genie and its bottle kind of like a Pokemon and a Pokemon ball. We don't know what it looks like in a Pokemon ball. The land beyond beyond from the world the past way around here. I bid you, genie, now appear. Name that movie. <laughs> Trevor will know it. All right. Uh, I like the colors here, though. Really nice. Yeah, the colors, colors are great. Yeah. No, I, I do like the crop some more. Really, you don't like the frame of the doorway? Kind of, especially it's so subtle. It's, it's almost like mm -mm. kind of bent to its will. Can't go back. Can't yeah. Go. Yeah, I like this. Yeah, I like well, this. I like the doorway frame. I like that you can see the whole foot in this room because it looks like he's stepping from the fog. I'm not. I don't really. The the door frame doesn't really have that big of an impact on me. I like the first. The first you guys one, like, me, don't you? Shape. You just hate I, me in my thoughts. I like the first <laughs> shot, but you like a foot on the second shot. Be yeah, shot. yeah, so I do. Those baby, he was those towels. I'm telling you, man, I'm going with the second shot. But that's you know, it's yeah. my show, my rules. Bye. Thank you, Archer. <laughs> it's my kickball. It's my hey, kickball. Man, look at this cool shot, man. Look, this guy's running between his legs. There's nothing but feet in this shot. Yeah, that's all feet. 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 All feet. All foot. I was trying to win a Mezco Monday. I don't know if I'm really that, you know. I could not get Constantine to behave right. I just was not getting that 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 running through his legs, stepping out of the way kind of thing. Like I couldn't. Well, I don't think I still don't think I nailed it. I don't think I got the. Well, kind of got to put the leg up like this, like motherfucker. You know? I honestly thought you were. He was kicking him back. Yeah, that's what I thought he was going to yeah, kick him with the back of the head. The problem with putting his leg up that high, you weren't able to see Jackie's face, and I wanted Jackie coming through the door because he's running from Jackie. You know, so I couldn't win. You could have moved Jackie to the side. <laughs> I couldn't win, Lou. Just listen. To what I'm <laughs> I couldn't win, Lou. To win, but he doesn't want to move him to the side. Anyway. I could have nerd, man. We got Greg Ooh. in the house, man. We got some uh, some Arizak. 
Arizak. Uh, the dude from D and D, the the or- 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 well, I don't forget his name is. Mm-hmm. Um, and then two of the wolf thingies and the magic user thingy and the Arizak. That's Arizak. Oh yeah. See now yeah. you're a little, you're an old hand at this. You know them all now. Because no, you I just I just, the other day. I just got him. I just got him. <laughs> Just because you bought some wizards the other day, now you know them all. You're a first name. Yeah, that's right. He's trying to all. get familiar with them. All. All. He's, so he's familiar with his figures now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Brian Lexi Lou Productions. What up, people? What up? What's up, everyone? What is going on? Lou, you keep playing with this badger. All right. Badgers, biker mice from Mars. I got my three biker mice from Mars. I'm happy. That's nice. Thanks. You want a hot dog? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, we're moving on. You got your, your two seconds. I was showing oh, the, man. I was, a picture, a man. I was just showing Pablo. I'm trying to make some progress this week, man. You are next up. progress. Now stay on target and move forward. That's that's right. nice stuff, though. The lighting on here is great, Greg. Like I love yeah. the, the the warmth that's coming up from behind them from that like that's a portal a broken or wall. did they break through the wall? It's kind of hard to tell. Although though, I am right? kind of curious, did they both crawl through that hole or just... it's not a tumor? Hold on, hold on. Um, that's a tight hole for that big guy. Well, I mean, he could have gotten on his knees and crawl through it. I mean, <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm just saying there was. <laughs> it was, just, it was yeah. a dope shot. You I, set I, me up for it too. <laughs> yeah, I, like I think the, the hole needed to be bigger. Awesome. That's all I'm saying. No, uh, the hole's fine. It's a tight fit. So, oh, the hole is fine. It's rare when the hole needs to be bigger. <laughs> I know, right? Right. It's not the size that counts. <laughs> it is a job of that yeah, you, on the left, man. You need some room, man. I will say I do like that you made the uh the um all fair and love and tail. Arizak's uh staff glow his uh yeah, the, the stone up there on the top. The I like that. That that's nice. I would have thrown more um, light through that hole though, Mike. I, I think you know I would have thrown more yeah. light through there and had some fog well, in there and had it kind of like you know fog would have definitely made the room behind them golder and it would look nice, yeah. Yeah, I agree with you on that. But that's you have to set up for a nice, good light beam through that hole because the 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 main shot is not too bright, so you're not going to drown yeah. it out too much. It's not going to be a lot of light, like throwing back at the camera. It's going to be just the light coming through that hole, and it's going to look pretty good there. So I'm sorry, Mike. I I walked over for you. Right, no, you're you're good. You're good, man. You're good. Do best. Good. All right, I don't do anything good. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> All right, Greg, man. Beautiful, beautiful, yeah, beautiful shot. shot. Beautiful shot. We're moving on. Toyetic forty, man. Oh, we got uh, we got this green headed dude. He's I like this shot. I like this shot. Yeah, man. And I was yeah. so excited to get this figure, the exclusive one with this head, but I prefer the standard head that comes with it. Yes. Uh, <laughs> I should I should have got this guy. Don't they have a good job? Like just stuff. regular, like he's he's cool. Like extra crispy. Like he's available. The standard version of this. Uh, he. I, I think the in-stock sale ended already, right? I'll find him over at Atlanta Toy. Uh, yeah, Toy he'll, Atlanta, yeah he'll, he'll get him at the. Yeah, he'll be. At the, I won't get him. I probably won't buy him, but uh, I will buy the 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 one we talked about the other day with the, the oh, skeleton okay. space. The space yeah, yeah, the yeah the Waltor. Um, yeah, whatever his name is. Oh, I ordered that one. Yeah, Waltor. Yeah, Maz, if you happen to find this guy, um, at, at um, Toy Atlanta, uh, Toy Atlanta, and you have extra spending cash, <laughs> I'll send you the money right away. <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm gonna have extra spending? I'm gonna be sitting there going, man. I'm gonna be like, hey man, here's a rib. Do you want a rib? I'll sell you a rib. Four hundred dollars. Nah, I'll send you the. Money. I need to buy a little rib. Four hundred dollars. Let me know how much he is if you see him. You send me a message. He should be. It's gonna be six 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 hundred dollars. I'll I be here on Friday seven. night, which means it shouldn't be sold out yet or something. So I should be able to give you a good in- indication of what's there. Because okay. I got the preview night too, and uh, the only day people go on Friday is if they buy that that three day package. So, I should ask Trevor. Trevor should know. I think it is thirty seven. I think he's a standard. Trevor's probably figure. okay. Now. Okay, probably- I'll shoot it to you. I'll shoot it to you day of, so that way you can grab it with um my money and then you just keep in mind. Green- Do you coming- want the green head one or not the green? No, head no, one? it won't come with the green head. Okay. The yeah, green head was an exclusive for um uh PowerCon. Oh, yeah, okay. so if you if you see it there, someone's uh flipping it, obviously. So it's gonna be double the money. Hmm. Anyway, on to the picture. I like yeah. this one. This is I like this one better than the last shot you did, Toyetic. Is it, I, th- I feel like the figure is lit up a little better. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm able to get a better indication of where everything is on him. 
Um, Trevor says he believes he's 37, so he's not dead at the time. Thank you. Uh, Trevor still it's, not a bad, it's a good price, man. Yeah, it's a good price. Yeah, because it's a, yeah, a good price. Yeah. Maybe I'll get them. Well, if you get it through the Four Horsemen table, I mean, I think actually that's the only way you can get it is through the Four Horsemen. I don't think you can buy this. Any, I don't think a retailer has this. I'm gonna try to film some footage of, the, of each day of the show, but you know how I am about editing footage and, and then posting it. So we'll see. <laughs> well, even if you don't post it, we can run through it on the live. Hmm. But I'll, I'll need good thumbnails. <laughs> wink, wink, nudge, nudge. <laughs> For day one, day two, and day three. <laughs> wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Oh, and you could probably pick up the PowerCon exclusive for seventy. What is that one? Is that the one? That's the one that comes with the green head. Oh, okay. All right. Um, but anyway, I like I like the uh, the lighting on the sword here. I like how the yeah, house, that, I know that's that, added probably in post. But I like how that yeah. came out, and it's it, it's a nice duality with the one over here on the hand. I think the lens flare on the hand needed to be a little a little bit softer. Yeah. Um, Pincy Pick says, I have a power con with green head and cape looking to trade for Zolocon. Is if any, I don't know what a Zolocon is. Um, and then, uh, Wade Create, what's up, fellas? How you doing, buddy? What's going on, man. Going yeah, on, to tell me what a, what a Zolocon is. I don't know what it is. It's a character, I don't know. It's a character, <laughs> it's, a, it's another con. They had another exclusive at Zolocon. Oh, okay, <clears throat> it's a character at Zolocon, so I don't know. Move on, I guess. Toyetic, thank you so much. Emerald Knight photos in the house. What's up, fellas? Uh, What's up, buddy? What's yeah. going on? Oh, snap. Pincy pics, man. Ooh. Like that. Is this a Mezco? Uh, yeah, it's, it's a Mezco. It's, like, it's, I have them right there. Awesome. You want Skull Man, Toetic says. Came with Skull Man. Oh, it's the two-pack. It's the... Oh, uh, okay. I know what he's talking about. No, no, no the Zolocon was Skull Man exclusive. Mm. It was a Skull Man exclusive? Yeah, the... He came with the... The red cape, red hood. I think that's his oh, name. Oh, I think that's his name, right? Skullman. That could be wrong. Trevor, Trevor, I think knows the name of that. But that was the Zolocon exclusive. It's the one he's looking for. All right. Just Jeff says Trevor is the Adventure People Cosmic Legion tribute of the show this weekend. Um, asking. He's asking. He's we asking. Uh, and then uh, Dentic. Denticus says, uh, make sure the cape is included. I think there was an issue with the cape not being packed in the box. Yeah, that was with the exclusive, but I think the standard yeah. edition has it. They made sure that the, it was in there. All right. Moving yeah. on to Pensy Picks, though, who's been waiting very patiently for us to go over his picture or their picture, I should He's say. Been waiting patiently. <laughs> um, dude, this is this is cool, man. Uh, I don't usually like Scott Summers too much, but you know, this is a nice shot. I yes. definitely am sick of his 90s look, but I still like the look. I still like the shot. I like the, the pinks in here. I like the colors. Yeah. The like, yeah, the lighting the is fantastic. More hot light. Oh, mm -hmm. nice. and, and I love the, the effect that you used on the eye beam. You know, it looks good. Even though it's a plastic eye beam piece, you got the light shining through it and it makes it look pretty legit. I'm digging that, man. Yeah. Well, it looks yeah. like you did that in post because um, what you would call it, the light when it pipes, when it shines through there, it doesn't look like that. <laughs> yeah. Mm. But it, it looks cool. works out, man. It works out. We did a great job with this. Uh, looks nice. Those blues and pinks go good yeah. together. <laughs> yeah, really nice complementary colors there. Yeah, I would have just put a little bit more saturation on the um, light that's coming bleeding onto his chest and thigh um, area that's coming from the optic blast because it looks like a lot of that light is coming more towards his right side versus coming from him dead from his face. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Um, I, I really interesting. Think... Sorry, go ahead. Oh, go ahead. No, 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 go ahead. No, you go ahead. It's, I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out the 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 composition. He's doing this. I mean, it's it, it's a good it's it's a good composition. I, I just I'm trying to figure why why he's center and maybe and 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 then the effect is cut off, um, and he wasn't more to the right. Yeah, more to the uh, third. third is that more here? Yeah, the yeah. Yeah, I was just trying to figure that out. But I mean it, it looks good anyway. I mean, yeah. I just wondered why he wasn't more over to the right on the thirds, but but you know, or it wasn't a uh a portrait orientation, but it looks good. I like it. I like there's mm -hmm. a lot even though there's there's not a lot going on in the back, there's really nice colors that complement each yeah. other and there's you know, it just looks good. So mm -hmm. I would have played with the pose a little more though. I don't like how straight yeah. up and down he is. Uh I would have had him uh you know in a low crouch leaning forward with his head looking upwards more so his head's looking straight from that lean forward 
and then like like he's really like in it because he's got that yell on his face like he's giving it and Lou's shaking his head because he thinks he knows better than I do. No, you can't not with Cyclops because he has um the lighter the features light, the neck. The light. Oh, you can't tilt light. the neck. Oh yeah, neck. That's the only. That's what Blue Tax for. That's true. <laughs> Yeah, but then he wouldn't. He wouldn't have the the light up feature in the. Yeah, do you need it? I never use the light up features. I don't. You I don't, don't put batteries in anything. <laughs> on his inner arm, where's where's the light source for what's on his inner arm? Uh, other arm on his. Oh, oh there, yeah. right the two dots. Those two dots. Where where are those two dots? Where's the light source coming from? From those. That's, over here, that's a, um, a reflection from the light that's mm -hmm. hitting him from the left side, which is what I'm saying. Like there's too much light on this side versus being dead center on him because all that pinkish red should be coming directly from his eyes. So it shouldn't be bleeding behind him. It should be dead in front of him. Mm. But um, Maz, when you take off his neck, he has no ball joint. So yeah. you could try to get away with the blue tack, but there goes his eye beam. But um, it yeah, you could try to get away with it, but it you have to really like get that angle up. Yeah, yeah. Hey, that's what I do. That's what I do, man. I get the angle up, but man. Lot. Look how big he's that got. Hole is. He's got a big neck hole. Yeah. <laughs> that's a huge hole, man. That's a huge hole, bro. That's a huge. This hole. is one of those times where the hole doesn't need to be bigger. <laughs> but, it's like throwing I, a hot dog down a hallway. <laughs> you can park your bike in an airplane hangar. That's an orbit. <laughs> All right, Pensy picks them in. Big shot. Good man. shot. I really dig this man. Um, we're gonna I move like on. It. What is just like Jeff saying stuff. here, real quick though? Um, that head sculpt without the blast effect is a thing of nightmare. It is kind of true. Yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. And Newell, man, we got some more changing up. And instead of walking, though, we're crawling through a dirt thing. But uh, you know, get the Maester Union uh, veteran William uh, right here. Like and the werewolf is out in the daytime. That's interesting because werewolves are night creatures. So veteran William, he can be out whenever he wants. He's veteran William. Yeah, yeah, he can. <laughs> uh, this is a good looking figure, though, man. But uh, that 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 uh, Bestley Studio, no, no, yeah, Bestley Studios, uh, soft goods, though, man, or is it J? No, J Lab. J Lab. Kai Lab. Yeah, Kai Lab. Kylab, that's the one you said, yeah. yeah. Jlab, Kylab, which is it? Well, his Instagram is J J Kylab or something. Yeah, Kylab. It's Kylab. Oh, yeah, it's Kylab. Yeah, at least that's his uh, his name brand. Uh, it's a nice daylight light though, but yeah, I do kind of question the werewolf in the day. But I mean, the picture looks nice. Yeah, um, but it looks like he's kind of just laying down, and holding himself with his hands too. I don't it know. Was if it's... Well, yeah. I mean, it was a rough night. Yeah, it was a rough night. Lightning can come out during the day. I mean, if I we guess don't... sure. We learned know. anything from Underworld. They were out in the day. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Sure. All right. Only vampires that don't can't hang out in the day. Yeah. Double dumb ass on me. If if, it's, if you're considering this guy uh, like and he can transform anytime he wants without the moon. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there you go. I do like the sunlight <laughs> on him though. It's a nice lighting on him, but it you know, I, I, I do still question the validity of whether it should be shot in the daytime. Not whether it could be, but whether it should be. Um, I might have softened the light up a little bit. Mm. Uh, since it's natural light, I mean, I, I just might have softened it up a little bit with the diffuser. Are you soften that. Explain to the to the crew how you soften that in the daytime. Just throw a diffuser up over it, or a white T-shirt, or uh, you know, get yeah. your little circular diffuser that has a reflector. Break or light up. Or a gold something and, something yeah. light can go through, but yet soften it. Yeah, yeah. That's uh, why I broke the rules too. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Twilight did. Uh, well, we don't talk about Twilight. <laughs> yeah, that's not even that doesn't even count. <laughs> we, <laughs> no, man, thank you so much for sharing. something about <laughs> glitter vampires, <laughs> but dazzled vampires. Oh, oh, I love this. this I remember one, when the little shot, man. Is this the hot toys Grogu or uh, 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 uh not Grogu, uh, 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 uh group? group? Yeah, yes, this yeah, is the new is. one. I kind of wish I, I bought this group, man. I could have me too, man. Uh, I might pick it up this summer, we'll see. I don't know this if I'm going to pay for it, man. There's just, just too much stuff coming out, man. I still haven't bought Shin yet. I bought Balin, but I didn't buy Shin. Yeah, I'm not buying those. I'm, like They look great. I'm not buying oh, them. I bought Balin because I, I need a Ray Stevens or something, man. I liked his acting, man. I I, I liked him ever since Rome. I was like, and yeah. I liked Balin. You know, so. I, I, I'm not buying it. I have no space for it. But this I have space for because my wife has her own collection of stuff that I bought her for Hot Toys. And yeah. it's all one-to-one -one scale stuff. And now so, I'm also trying to debate whether or not I need to track down a wrecker because I have a crosshair. He's the hardest one to get. 
And I kind of want to put together the Bad Batch now, kind of. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. I, I, oh, get shot by, by, by Anthony. I, I liked yeah. it when he posted this. It was, mm -hmm. it was yeah. Yeah. very nice. Anthony, this is just this is just awesome. I, I like just it. love I the expression. On, yeah, on he's got that, oh, well, that's the figure, man. The figure's yeah. got that little expression. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, but I'm only like, the this one has it. The shot, like what's going on in the shot, is what I'm saying. The story yeah. told really well with that expression. He's yeah, he's got the particles on his on his like, feet I know the and everything, dope. and he's you know mm -hmm. looking good. I really, I would love to put him with my my baby Grogu. You know, you know, I think they'd be make a cute I, couple. I have uh, him in the Ravager suit. Right next to Grogu. Now, where's this suit from? Is this just some custom uh, stuff you did, yeah, Anthony? Yeah. Oh, that's, that's from the um, I Am Group uh, series. So he has oh. um, the pajamas and oh, then that's right. all the uh, swappable parts. Mm -hmm. <coughs> two different baby groups. There's the I Am Group one, and then there's the Guardians Two group. Is that yeah. right? And I have the Guardians. So this is the this is the other the 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 Groot series one. Yeah, I kind of want this one. Yeah, this one is actually the more fun one um, mm -hmm. between the others because he has so many interchangeable parts. You can make him look like a chia pet. You could, you know, yeah, have that's him. right. <laughs> I'll have to look into that one, man. I really will. <coughs> oh, dang it. Is that by oh. Hot Toys also, or who's yeah, it? Yeah, this is Hot Toys. This is life size. Yes, one to one. Yeah, one to one. So he's about the size of a six scale figure. That's what life size is for him. But yeah. Uh, a little bit taller. Not, yeah, he's about 14 <laughs> inches tall. How about that? Make you feel better? All right. Uh, Anthony, man, beautiful shot, Anthony. And don't forget, man, I'm still gonna get with you after Toy Lanta, so don't don't get all worried about the. Uh, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, this is a great shot, man. Great shot. Moving on, Raven Eye Studio. This is cute little. Is this the Funko Pop? Yeah, the Funko February. Yeah, the Funko Pop. This is actually. I don't hate this Funko Pop. This is actually cute. I like this one. <laughs> um, if they did the turtles like this, I would have bought those turtles. But no. Yeah, yeah, this Brian. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I was just telling Brian what you understood that was uh, the Sir Dork Mutable Challenge. Um, dude, I love the lighting on this. This is like the light that's blue is coming through this doorway, and he's, he's explained that really well. And then the warm length over here, and just it works really well. This is one of my favorite shots you've done, Raven. And it's a fun yeah. prop. Go, go, go <clears throat> shoot me now. I can't believe I'm saying this. You know? And it's <laughs> properly, it's like put in a nice position. It's not. Crazy, it, and you got the it, catch light in the eye. Yep, so yep. And you know what? I think I think it's because of the body, the way it is, it just looks like a baby got delayed. It yeah, doesn't, it's so yeah. Cool. Mm -hmm. and it pairs really nice with the baby Groot shot we just looked at. Just two cutenesses in a row, <laughs> two, cutenesses. Yeah. two cutenesses in the row. <laughs> nice, man. I you like tag Sir Dork cute on this one, man. I like this. Yeah, hashtag Sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do what it's Casper, hashtag us. Show us that hashtag. Uh, all right. Anybody else on Raven, man? Oh, so the deluxe version is the one that comes with the PJs. I'm sorry. Okay. Deluxe Are you looking for it now? You're like, hmm, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The but um, how much is it? <laughs> well, so the regular, I guess the standard one or whatever is nope. two thirty four. The deluxe, I uh, the deluxe. Was, Can you still find it retail? Well, BBTS has the standard version. I don't oh. know about the deluxe. The deluxe is the one that has the pajamas, mm. and you get the extra um the the translucent group the figure. Yeah, yeah. Because that translucent figure is a separate alien that shapeshifts. So it yeah. So. I don't know if they have both, but I know they have that one in stock. Uh, Sideshow still got I Am Groot Collector's Edition. Deluxe Edition is weightless full. All right. Mm -hmm. But that was... Uh, see, now you got me on a tangent. It doesn't tell me how much it was because I got the weightless full they thing. Oh, 280. 280. Yeah. yeah, 280 for the deluxe and 234 for the standard. Yeah. Stay on target. Yeah, stay yeah, on target. Sorry, man. Sorry. He had me looking. Um, you got me looking. Raven eyes, man. This is cute. Thank you so much. This is great. Uh, Bronx Bat, this is four. I like what you're doing here, though. A little hot on the light. I would have told you. hot on the light. Yeah, I would have dialed. Maybe like, you need to put a diffuser. I think you're missing a diffuser. Or like, just get a. Yeah. You can use a, a white pillowcase or get hmm. some. Um, Racing uh, paper or yeah, or, 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 or the, the not the wrapping paper with the, the tissue paper you get for wrapping presents and stuff. Yeah, you can do that too. 
That's cheap. That's like maybe a dollar for a pack of it, you know? So you just, and that'll, and that'll help make your light source bigger because it'll spread it. And it'll soften, and it'll soften those soften, harsh it'll soften, and stuff. Yeah. So, yeah. Good stuff, though, Bronx Bat. Good stuff. We'll move on. Ooh, toy oh. immersion, man. Look at the Zeus, man. That's my baby. Is this? this is a six scale. Is this? No, no, no. That's, that's a one ten. No, is it one twelve or one twelve? Is that is that no, one twelve? Five K toy. No. It's on five K. Yeah, it's on five K. Yeah, Zeus. Yeah, that's I like cool that. Shot, when he man. posted that shot, it looks so good. Yeah. Does his arm not go further back though? Because I'd want his arm more back. I don't know, actually. You know what I'm saying? Like, like hinge this back more and talking about like a proper. Yeah, yeah. Proper. It looks like he's in mid throwing. Maybe but, I don't know. It's he's a god. He doesn't need to put so much force into. It. He just point you. That's what he needs to do. I'm saying they will look better. Look better. Uh, I would agree. I would agree. Yeah, and, uh, the colors here are great. I mean, you match oh, the, the lighting is beautiful. Really well. The lighting, the, lighting nice. and the whole concept on this shot yeah. is beautiful. The whole thing is great, yeah. Mm -hmm. The tilted, the tilted pillars, the the stance, yeah. the the golden warm. Mm -hmm. It just it looks really nice. Although the stance kind of reminds me of someone doing the rain dance. Yeah. <laughs> you can kind of see through his loincloth. It would make sense because he has lightning and he's you know. Mike, he was a tow guy. I didn't know you. Were <laughs> well, I mean, it's, it's lit up, up you know. It's, so, up. it's bubble uh, fit. It's it thing, is Mike. lit up, so you know. Hey, listen, listen. He 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 said no. I'm not looking at the helmet. I'm looking at the tunic, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I love those skulls on the floor, and and just his, the whole thing just looks really good. I love the, the I love it. Oh, it's dope. Yeah, very, very. Sweet. All right, next up. I'm thanking somebody. Oh, okay. Sorry, somebody commented on my TikTok, and nobody ever does anything on my TikTok. So I figured I should Why cultivate are you that. On your TikTok. We, we don't do. Huh? Why are you on your TikTok? Because somebody, I I got a notification. No, no. At it. no. you don't TikTok on while we're on a stream. <laughs> I, I, in my hot body, I do what I want. No excuses. <laughs> Dude, look at the pop filler, man. He's popping it. Some one piece style, man, or two pieces. How many pieces is there? Three, four. Three, I don't four. Know. You get I only knew it's the hat. That's all I knew. <laughs> um, what do you guys think of it? Man? I, I talk a lot. Ooh, we got a private chat. <laughs> I talk a lot. Uh, Mike says I got like ten minutes, friends. It's a cool shot. <laughs> I, I, mm. <laughs> I kind of want a, a tighter crop, but then you would lose the. I mean, I, 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 you'll lose his big fist coming from. You know, he's. Mm -hmm. Is that his big fist? Is feel like it's in the background? Oh, it's his big fist. Fist. We'll yeah. See. He's yeah, he's bringing that he's bringing that arm from behind for because he can like he's kind of like elastic y like Mister Fantastic and mm. yeah you know, elastic. Oh, man. that's his. That's his fist. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, yeah it's, it's supposed to be his fist. Yeah. I think it's a digital representation of his fist, personally, but it's supposed no, to be his fist. We, we, we know it's a digital representation. We're saying I don't think the figures really got that fist. <laughs> I'm trying to understand the angle of it if it's gonna if it's, it's Boba to Fett. Good. Yeah. No, I like the way this figure looks though, man. Yeah, I no, like the yeah, the highlights and the shadows on the lighting of, of this mm -hmm. figure. There's a lot of texture there, really soft pink skin. I, I like it. I think it oh, you like that soft pink like skin, do you Mike? <laughs> yeah, of he course. walked right into that. <laughs> Jeez, a slippy slide, baby. Slippy slide. <laughs> sorry, continue, Mike. I'm sorry. No, but it no, is. You're good. Uh, it is I like nice it's sandals. Yeah, it's chunkless. It's chunkless. The flip flops. The trailers. <laughs> Yeah, this is a beautiful look on the figure. I don't know if I'm I'm a big fan of all the. Uh, I mean, I understand it's supposed to represent his big fist and all. I don't know if I'm a big fan of all that, but I do like the lighting on the figure itself. Toy more than the house with Luffy. It all works, Rubber Luffy. Man. Luffy. Oh my bad. Luffy. Luffy. I Luffy. wouldn't have. I wouldn't have got from the shot that that was his fist. I what I got. <laughs> but I don't know this figure. What I got from this shot was somebody was punching at him and he was like flying and out of the way that's what Ooh. i got from but i don't know this figure so that's probably my fault you know 
Yeah. Kenny Lang, Arnold from behind, sounds like loco language. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. He's not even here to defend himself. You go. You That's go. good. Better, better that way. <laughs> All right. The pot fella, man. Like I said, beautifully yeah. lit on him. Oh, there. Oh, yes, whoa, yes. Whoa, what? I love oh, the way oh, the lights the come through the fingers. Oh, you look a little pale. And you look a little pale there. <laughs> yeah, you okay? That's how I feel. Don't call on us, man. I just get over hey. stuff. No, it's like a little uh, day quill, so I don't know what I'm going to say. Look out. <laughs> it's better than Nog. It's better than, got to be better, better than Eggnog. Hey, 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 egg hey, egg Eggnog was, was fantastic. Eggnog egg talked is horrible. Nog like, might be better. Never got a Thanos look going on right now. <laughs> I do You're like the light. Not, that that the fan, what are you trying to say, Lou? That's not nice. No, yeah, I, I agree with you. I don't know if it's the yeah. color of him, combination of his uh, sweater and him being pale, that he has like a Thanos thing going on on my camera, like on my Poor phone. Trevor, just let him get comfortable before you start jumping all over him. Well, I, I want to know if he's okay. He, he looks a little flushed. Uh, like, yeah, not really. Like, blink oh, twice if we need to send assistance. <laughs> How's that? Do I look a little better now? There you go. Yeah, this is a little warmer. warmer. A little warmer. A little warmer. <laughs> yeah, yeah. man. Thank you so much for sharing. Um. All right, let's move on. Oh, what we got? Oh, this Raven is, Eye Studio. This, is, uh, Star Trek, this right? is a weaker one, man. This is where's your focus? Yeah, I was gonna say where's the focus on this? Focus show? is like non-existent here, buddy. Non. So maybe that Punisher look like Ray Liotta. <laughs> <laughs> was... I'm sorry, he looks like Ray Liotta, don't he? <laughs> a little bit. I can see it. <laughs> From Goodfellas or something, you know. Yeah. Yeah, where is the focal point? I don't. Yeah, it just needed to have a focal point either on. It would have to be on Daredevil, not the Punisher, because Daredevil was the one that threw the baton or his yeah. pinky sub at, at the back of a Punisher's head by the looks of it. Yeah. Is it composited? Why does it look like Daredevil's composited over the bike? I don't know. It might just be me. No, I think it's I think it's all one shot, but the sharpest part of this shot is it's hard to tell if it's Daredevil's front hand or his back hand. They're both I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, that doesn't make sense though, because if it neither of them Yeah, I'm not sure where his focal point is at. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's more like on the wall or something. I don't yeah, know. I was about to say the eye, yeah. but even the wall looks a little. Yeah, I can't I don't know what's going on with his foot either. Yet. Where's his foot? This one's behind the gun. Somewhere. Oh, that's the gun. I was like, what is that's that? The gun right there. Oh, right there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Man, that knee joint mm. is horrible looking on that Marvel Legends Daredevil. <laughs> it really is, right? Mm. Such a huge gap. Oh, so this is Bond <laughs> hitting him across the head. Yeah, 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 that's what I was saying. He threw the billy club behind Punisher's head. I'm so confused. Yes, <laughs> we all are confused. <laughs> Raven eyes, man, you, you killed it on that last one we went over with the little. What was it? The the. the uh... You have a makings of a good shot here, though. But yeah, it just need you need a you need to have a a focal point somewhere, and I would focus on Daredevil's face because he's your main subject yeah. in this shot. Yeah. Yeah, and Punisher's got to be reacting to getting hit in the head, too. Yeah. Something. It was even hit. I don't even know. And I'd cut that blue light. That noise? <laughs> yeah, and cut and the I'd, blue. Yeah. And I'd cut that blue light because it's pretty, pretty drowning. It's drowning everything on that side. Yeah. All the whites. All the whites. Blue, the yeah. wall. The wall it looks like it has a little bit of warmth. Yeah. That one mm -hmm. little section. But yeah. I, yeah. I mean, yeah, the makers of a good shot here. It's just, yeah. 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 Some tweaking, and then you. I would try to redo the shot. Yeah. Yeah. With this one, let's just uh, let's just try it again. And I could and I could tell that's a Harley in the back. See that puddle of oil under it? Look at that. Little <laughs> puddle of oil under I used to I used to have Harley bags, and so I could. <laughs> we just had our driveway pressure wash this past weekend. Right? <laughs> I love that. <laughs> All right, Raven Eye Man. Good, this good is your third or fourth one anyway. We're gonna move on. Thank you so much. Oh, look at that. Oh, Trevor, oh what do you know? <laughs> so convenient you're here for this. <laughs> wow. It's a total coincidence. It's a coincidence. You're like 
I, I no, I've been waiting like a month and a half for one of my shots to come up. No, I, <laughs> I just thought I'd answer any questions. If you had any questions. Last week I had like four shots all come at once, so you know. Mm. I love the lighting on this shot. Like the the oranges, the pink, and the blue. <laughs> so, such a concert yeah, it, was, it was fun um, to try and recreate the stage look. I mean, it's not it's not difficult. You yeah. know, you get a couple little gelled lights in the back there, and it kind of looks like spotlights on the mm -hmm. you know on the on the figure. Um, I had two. Did I have another one on? The, yeah, it was a black and white, but it's not as good. Um, yeah, I try. I don't know if the people in front are a little lost, but they're, they're sort of there. I kind of I try to make it look like kind of a concert shot hey, shot from the, the audience. Yeah, you can see the hands. I see them throwing up the horns. Yeah. 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 Now, yeah. are the glasses that reflective? <laughs> What's up? Are, the, are his glasses that reflective or did you add that in post yeah no that's that's the reflection so nice. it worked out pretty well because you can't yeah. see me i don't think no no i see the hands of the body <laughs> yeah i think it, it worked out pardon <laughs> you were at that yeah, concert exactly. yeah i was in the third row i'm right there <laughs> right on <laughs> Uh, so, uh, but I love these yeah. Marshall stacks. These are really cool, and yeah, JD nice. up there. It's a, it's a cool figure. I mean, it's 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 simple, but uh, I kind of like the, I kind of dig these musician figures. So did that, mic yeah, that well microphone stand come with this figure? Yeah, because I mean that's pretty unique to him. He's always he's always like leaning up, and you know that's awesome. I like the little touch of the up. of the bottle on the on the amp. Yeah, we well, always had JD. That was his thing too. Yeah. So there was always JD on on the. Uh, it's a tricky, fi tricky figure to get the hands in a, a decent position. But I mean, as a basis, he's kind of like you know, doing kind of like a side pick or whatever. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. It's a good shot. Yeah. I love the shot. Fantastic. Yeah. Let me uh, give a shout out to Collecting Brothers, who's new apparently. Uh, how does one get their photos critiqued by all you amazing, wonderful people? Thank you so much for that. And uh, for that, I I've already tagged the. Uh, I can't figure what I'm doing. All right, here's the uh, tag right here, Toy Photography Talk, and uh, we are scrolling up, so we'll probably get to you within a month, maybe. Uh, yeah. But we're we're working on it. So, we're working uh, on it. Yes. Nobody's getting yeah. missed. So tag us and come back in about six weeks. No, well, not that far. <laughs> I'm sure, okay, we're better we, than that. We put a we put a, a good sized dent. <laughs> we tried. We tried. Anyway. We tried. Uh, and you're welcome. Yes. But I, uh, you do get a feel. Uh, this shot like you're sitting there in the yeah uh -huh. sort of like a row and getting you know definitely looks like that yeah good stuff man excellent excellent Great. stuff um look right, Trevor time. again did you what plan this? no you plan this? I think you plan this <laughs> <laughs> no Moz Moz is the one that plans his shots I don't think Trevor, <laughs> I don't think Trevor planned it. <laughs> And no, I, I kinda, how can I plan this? I just forget to uh, tag anything until it's too like it's it's a month <laughs> later, and then I'm like, well, I won't be seeing this for like three three months. Um, I like this figure, man. This is gonna be a dope. Figure. I love this figure, man. I went out and bought that little Fisher Price dude. Oh, to, did you? To, yeah, yeah there I, go. I love these things, man. Fisher Price these were, So this is yeah, these are Fisher, Fisher Bright. These are Fisher Price Adventure people. Hold on, hold on. Let me do the camera. So yeah. Oh, wow. What? Yeah, so the, the Fisher, Fisher Price Adventure people. They were great, man. They had like the little ships and there was like campers and then they did a whole space thing where they had like a bunch of different space figures and stuff. Where is that figure and this... here? Pardon? I'm looking at the picture. Where is that figure? No, that this figure is a the, tribute. The guy in the front oh. is a tribute to that figure. Oh. Yeah. I, I, I'm not stupid, I promise. <laughs> yeah, they, they, you know, they do Motu tributes. They've done... You know some other things tribute to people, but this one is a tribute to the Fisher Price little gotcha. people. So all right, all right, all right, that makes sense. All right, I felt like I was missing something, and I was. Yeah. So yeah, these I'm are fish sure. tank trees, like those little root things, and then the background is like an AI thing that I put together. That's awesome. Uh, yeah. To kind of match them, and uh, <clears throat> yeah, let's try to make it alien worldish. The alien, the AI stuff has been pretty awesome, man. You just gotta, you gotta keep patient with it, man. You gotta keep. Yep. Plug in, generate, generate, generate. Eventually, it might come up with something. You get there is there isn't. Uh, well, I almost said art, but there is a there are techniques to it. There are uh, specific um, commands and stuff that you can do to get get certain yeah. uh, results and stuff. But uh, I tried to ask yeah. for dead bodies yesterday. It wouldn't give me that. It's no. Like, yeah, they have like yeah, yeah, yeah. 
was that wait a minute photoshop or mid journey photoshop that's what i have oh, yeah photoshop has a lot of like restrictions man like mm-hmm. even like sometimes when you have like a, a figure that's like a uh like like spider-man or batman it won't do anything with it because it's like it recognizes it a licensed character or something like yep. that. that's crazy hmm. i haven't had that problem yet but... mid journey doesn't have that problem though Mm-mm. all right great cool stuff, stuff man. Yeah, no, cool i like stuff. the lighting on this too awesome mike uh, are you still doing all right you need to go yeah, no, I was looking at something online from. Mine, you phone. said you had ten minutes, and that was like over ten minutes. Yeah, ago. yeah, yeah. I'll probably I'll, I'll go over a couple more. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, Articulated well, lines, man. This looks like a, a cosplay shot. This looks really cool. I love that shot. Yeah, yeah that's three zero figure is cool. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This is awesome. So awesome. So awesome. Is this the um? <laughs> Wait. Yeah, it's the Ashley Wood three A. Wood three A one. Yeah. Yeah. Wade, Wade says, command, make my photos better. Doesn't work either. <laughs> <laughs> uh, reminds me when we, when we first started learning to program computers, or when Commodore 64 came out, we had to write a little program. Remember Commodore 64? Oh, yeah. And, uh, and yeah. we had to make a car go across the screen yeah. and, and just like Wade. Oh, yeah. Com- I remember that. Command. My photo better. I used to say, "Make car beep beep." I, I, I just didn't know how to do it. <laughs> so, so wait, wait. That comment reminded me of that. <laughs> I love it. Oh, I like this shot. That's beep. real basic, basic. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Make car beep beep. Run. Beep, beep. Tight, it it didn't more. work. It didn't work. Um, but as as to this picture, man, I, I honestly, at first glance, I thought this was a cosplay. And I thought it was pretty good too. The photo was like one of the better. No, the light, the light is fantastic on here. But yeah, um, this is obviously yeah. out there, like really out there. Although you can really tell if he, well, not that you can really tell, but it looks like he added a vignette in post. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The, yeah. The, the what edge of of play photographers like to do. Yep. Yeah, I might have just off centered him a little bit to give him some space on the right side of the frame to walk in too. But yeah. you know, but I don't want to say nothing because it's just a fantastic. It just looks really good, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a pretty um, shot of a nice looking figure. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, really nice and clean, nice colors. Like the colors, yeah, very clean. Yeah, Contrast. Very clean. What scale is that figure? What can you one buy six. that figure? I believe it was a one six. Oh, wow. one six. Six. Ah, forget it. Yeah, it's one six. <laughs> we <laughs> will break you one day. Courage, David. <laughs> no. No, <laughs> I, I think they Lou. Lou's already doing one six. Huh? Nah, I'm not. I, I got no desire for that at all. I have one somewhere. Here. Monster Force. There's some. There's some figures like that that look like this sort of in Monster Force, Mike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah this is true. That's from Fresh Monkey, right? The other ones that do the Monster Force. Yeah. yeah. Yep. yep. All right. Let's see what else we got. Artillery. Very nice. Times. Thank you so much. Raven on it again, man. Uh, I, I think you did it better the He's first time. Man. This was yeah, he did, yeah. But I think the first did. time, yeah, uh, was was the best. Uh, yeah, the lighting was better on that on the first yeah. Godzilla shot that he had. But we're gonna move on because this is like your fifth or sixth shot, man. But uh, good stuff, though. Good, good shot though, too. But yeah, <laughs> the other one was stronger. Eddie is one is number two with some cable. I would have softened this up a little bit. Yeah, it's a little too hot. Too strong, too hot. Yeah. Crisp, too crisp, too what defined. Here? Here? Oh, okay, and just that. Lab. Yeah. Other than that, uh, maybe you try to get a little bit more light to define this gun because you get like a lot of black here. To yeah. your composition, the the Dutch angle is not too bad, but I think I would have <clears throat> a little less on it, maybe. Mm-hmm. But it, it does work though for for this shot because like the the where the gun is. At that corner, and then he has the other hand yeah. almost near the other corner. Like it kind of cuts the sh- the photo, and and also gets the, the, that comic book panel, like he's kind of leaning back. Yeah, kind of thing. It kind of works. It, it works. Yeah, it works. Yeah. But yeah, I would cut back a little bit, dial that down a bit. It's a little yeah, bit too a little, hot. Little little sharp here and hot. Yeah. Um. But yeah. Good stuff, man. Oh wait, what Check. do we got here? What do we got here? Trevor's doing something. Check this out. He, he's googling. <clears throat> Have you ever done uh, this? Oh yeah, Google. Yeah, I know it's Google. Yeah. yeah. Have you have you have you done this though? Do you see it? Dutch angle. <laughs> do you Deutsch. see do you see what's going on? <laughs> no, you just oh, yeah, it's, it's crooked. The whole screen yeah, is crooked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you Google Dutch angle. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Everything yeah. comes in at an angle. <laughs> oh, does it really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at it. Oh, snap. <laughs> I, thought, I thought you were doing that. <laughs> no, no, look at look, that's it. Does that's the Grogu one still work? That's funny. Oh, I don't know. Because I remember I haven't done that in a Grogu, while. Where Grogu came, came out, and like if you were clicking on things he didn't like, he kind of made things disappear, or like he would change things on the mm. <laughs> on, on Google. <laughs> mm. What's the point right, of a tangent. dutch angle? Tangent. No. <laughs> no. Yeah. no, sort of. <laughs> sort of. Moving on. <laughs> Eddie, man, this is nice. Uh, I like this, Eddie. Eddie. Yeah, good shot. Yeah, yeah. man, it's, it's really clean. It's really nice. Yeah. Eddie again, man. Batman Ooh. and the Joker. Too much blue, I think. And his like mouth is really soft. I don't know what is his skull or your focus because he doesn't look too soft. But this looks like a yeah, the mouth right Ooh. looks looks. It almost looks like it's got a mask over a mask. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I'm like not gonna a, comment. Eddie, Eddie Joker, man. <laughs> I, I I had I I had a a. Uh, I could picture what, what you were about to say, Mike. <laughs> I, I have oh, the deliverance quote to come up on that, but I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> Yo, Adrian says, "Hold on, that's my photo." What? The photo? <laughs> Wait, which is your photo, Adrian? I don't see no photo of you. Adrian hey, Photography Twenty Two. Was that Adrian? Uh huh. What? Back up. This is Adrian's Photography Twenty. No, no, no. Go forward. That's Adrian's photography twenty two. Is that another Adrian? Oh wow! Account? It said Eddie first, right? <laughs> it oh, did. I thought it did. Yeah, it, it, yeah, it, it said Eddie. Eddie. It yeah, it did say Eddie, Eddie. and then what's well, yeah, That is weird. <laughs> no, so Adrian, weird. I'm sorry to you. What face is this? What did you do to this face? <laughs> that is so. I don't weird. know what it's figure that is. Is that a what is that? Is that a, a McFarlane? I think that's a McFarlane. I know that Joker's Mesco. I think that's McFarlane. It's a custom. It's a custom. It looks like the Supreme Knight Batman with a custom head sculpt and a custom chest. No, piece. that's not that's not cloth. Doesn't the Supreme Knight there. have a magnetic chest piece? That's not it, cloth goods it, there. That's plastic. Pieces is, is not cloth goods, but the arm is. And uh it looks like they mix and matched a lot of the parts. Uh, I don't think that arm is cloth goods either. That's not cloth goods, that's plastic. Yeah, I don't think it's plastic. Think, yeah, I don't Third think so. party extreme toys. Oh, it's an extreme toys. There you go. All right. Extreme toys. All right. Um, toys yeah, that the are extreme. On here is really distracting. I don't know if you couldn't focus in right or if it's just a soft sculpt. I think, I think it's just a sculpt. I don't think it's. I think that's the sculpt. Yeah. Because Joker. It reminds me of like the old PS2 games when they like put like a flat like face on top yeah. of the character. And that's kind of. Wait. Like, like I'm getting some Tomb Raider vibes right now. Like Laura Croft face. Mm. It almost. You know, I, I thought you said it. Tumor Raider. A, a warm yeah. life on the Tumor Raider. Tumor Raider. She's not a Tumor Raider. Tumor Raider. What's the matter with my, uh, my ears tonight? <laughs> I don't know, Mike. It's past your bedtime. <laughs> You're probably right. I, I think he needed to cut it with a, a little I think bit. The Joker looks great. The Joker looks good. The lighting on him, but for some reason, everything else and Batman look. Too washed in blue. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I can't put, put my finger on it there. I don't know either. Like it's it's a it's definitely the a, like a composition thing, and I can't like like it might have been better with the Dutch angle, like Batman over the top of him. But I just like I feel like it needs he needs to be closer too. Like it's kind of like mm, I can see the that, action's yeah. a little stiff on Batman. That's what she said. Yeah. Uh, okay, is that the type of show we're running here? It could, here? Be. it could be. <laughs> it could be. It could be. Hey, is he just uh, uh, Batman's fists are so puny. Trevor, yeah. Trevor, Trevor tell us, I how mean, did you really feel when you saw Pablo trying to crop like you? <laughs> <laughs> That's why he got on the show. He's like, I better get in there. <laughs> mm. <laughs> the night will slowed him down for an hour and a half. That's what it was. That's right. He's like that bastard. <laughs> I miss one show, and he's like <laughs> taking <laughs> over the keyboard <laughs> shortcut scene. Captain Croc. <laughs> uh, small hands with issues. Yeah, with, with the thing, yeah, thing that's what I was gonna say, Adrian. I'm like his hands look so tiny compared to his big arms. Yeah, yeah that's true. But uh, yeah. yeah, man, it's it's a cool it's a cool concept. Uh, yeah, Joker turned out really well. Batman, a little iffy on that one. 
Um, especially with the small hands. Now I can't <laughs> see that. Thank you. I keep on I thinking just big friends. about carnies and their and their and their their hands. Why? <laughs> Remember that? Uh, yeah. it smells like cabbage, you know. It smells like cabbage, yes. Austin Powers. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, um yeah, it's, I mean I think, I think this could have worked and it might have looked less less space between them if you kind of did it over the shoulder of Batman, maybe I don't know. Yeah, yeah. That yeah, that yeah. Been, yeah. Um yeah, or I guess like I don't know, like the movement of him like taking him by the throat and slamming him up there, like just feels like it would need to his body would be more you know forced forward and maybe like he his wouldn't just be, would be ready to, to the wall like yeah. not just his shoulder blades but the rest of his back would probably be against the wall by now um yeah i mean even if it wasn't it's just in terms of like a good composition i think it would have been more interesting to have him a little closer in his face or something a whole you know not necessarily but, too close but like uh i don't know yeah but yeah. the prompts is is it's really easy to overexpose the Joker with that white, and he did a good job of you know dealing mm -hmm. with that. Like, really nice yeah. white on there, not overexposed at all. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's just angle; it's just a little flat. Maybe um, break it up with some color, like a, a yellow light or something. Mm -hmm. I go with a warm orange, like a warm, yeah, something warm, something because it's very cold. The, the light. Right here. <laughs> yeah, that's what something I was saying. In the phone booth, even something in the phone booth, maybe could have. Yeah, yeah, yeah nice. You could add a color. He's got a light yeah. there, but it's not bright enough. You're not yeah. seeing it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that would be a nice bit of lighting to add in yeah. there. But all right, Adrian, man, thank you so much for sharing. What we got here? Oh, the phone booth again with Adrian. Oh, is, nice. he, is he like on the suicide hotline? What's he doing? Whoa! <laughs> it, it was in the. It was in the top ten. Also, uh, not. Was it last week or the week before? Uh, I think it was last week, wasn't it? Not? Was it last week? Yeah. It was last I, week. I have posted under that the first thing that came to mind was that Adele song, Hello. Is he trying to get out of the Matrix? I don't get it. Hello from the other side? Is that the sound? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I like the concept. Of, I just don't know what he's doing. I mean, why is the gun up by his head? Where's the phone? Why? I mean, if he's in the phone booth, what, I'm so confused. The gun is the phone. <clears throat> What? There is no spoon. What? It's oscillating. The the gun is oscillating a frequency of conversation. There you go. He just he didn't have a quarter and he was pissed. Yeah. Okay. There you okay. go. All right. This is the mess. No, code. I mean I I liked I liked the I liked the, mm -hmm. I liked the mood of the shot. I think mm -hmm. it would have been. Yeah. Yeah. I think that would have been. Uh, just filling it, I would have liked to have seen him. Like even if you had to lift him up a oh. little bit. He said about like, the reboot, Adrian said. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Leave the reboot. I think it's going to be fine. I think you're all going to be eating I'm not going to eat crow. No, I, 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 uh, I, I, eating crow. The, the uh, other thing I don't like is that it's... If I eat anything, it's going to be like three months, four months later when it's on HBO Max. <laughs> That's the only thing I didn't like is that it's Eric again. They should have just had a different person okay, be the well, crow. I thought we were dumping this. You know, in the comic book, though, he wasn't like like the metal dude that... No. Uh, he was a punk. He had like a mullet and a like spiky hair. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he was a punk goth kid. Yeah. But I think it's I mean, just a different take. I think it's going to be fun. In the book, it's all Joy Division. That's goth music. Yeah. Yeah. Which, which wasn't in the movie either. Yeah, it was. Well, I not the entire it. soundtrack. No, I not the entire soundtrack. Dead Souls. That was one of the songs they used in the book. Was Dead Souls. That's the Jordan. Okay, oh, okay, Moss. No, I'm, I'm just saying. I'm sorry. I'm sick. <laughs> don't, don't mind book, me. Right? I have <laughs> the comic books too. It's the Nyquil. <laughs> it's the Nyquil kicking in. Night Nyquil kicking in. <laughs> no, Night Joy Crow. Division wasn't goth either. Yeah, you're right. Joy Division um, wasn't goth. Yeah. <laughs> All right, next. This is a good oh, shot. Man, though, I even I even put the fork in the hair. Look I that. saw. I saw. I was watching the show. I don't know if you noticed. <laughs> no, I didn't notice. so yeah. <laughs> I don't know <laughs> Remember, I tried cropping earlier, and <laughs> I'm just saying I think it's going to be good. And I think I think this is. This no, is I'm nice. gonna. I, I, I want to see it. I just don't like that it's Eric again. I, I think it would have been better if it wasn't Eric. It was just. Well, you else. notice the 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 four other movies they did afterward didn't do anything either. I think they had to kind of go with Eric to try to get some kind of traction. But true, it was bad. But yeah, 
All right, let's go. <laughs> Moving on. The crows. In a way, I kind of like the second one a little bit better, but I think the oh, first one would have been the like more, the one that had a more interesting yeah. if you like cropped it in on his face. You know what I mean? And, and maybe had the crow in the background or something, or a little closer or something, sitting on the phone. All right. Oh, I know he's sitting on the phone thing, but I don't know. Yeah. Just tighten it up a little bit. The two of those those two objects because they're kind of like they're they're pulling my eye back and forth. I don't know. It, it's not a bad thing, but it's just I don't know the space. I don't know. Well, Mike, you've got to go, guys. So I'm gonna let you go. go. I got to scram, guys. Mike, you scram. You behave yourself. <clears throat> Have fun storming the castle. Do you think it'll work? It's no storm in the castle, that's for sure. Too. <laughs> <laughs> but you guys have a great night. A lot of great Later, photos. Mike. Have a great night, Mike. Thank you for being here, man. Hey, See you, Mike. You guys take care, man. Right. See you. Feel, feel better. Thanks, man. Moving on. Let's Move down. Move. Moving on. We got uh, Warforged JP. We got to a Warforged pick finally. Um, wow. This is a different, oh, different perspective. Yeah. Completely. I like this shot, man. This is one of my, this is like uh, an awesome. I think the Dutch angle is a little too, too strong. I think it's a little too strong. In my opinion, it's a little too, you know, angled. It's making me want to do this. <laughs> it's making me want to tilt my head a little bit. I, like I think it. this has been a crop to um, like a horizontal. Hmm, see, do you see like the like look at the the right hand side, like where the arrow is to to go to the next page. Like there's texture there in the sand, and then it like fades out to like yeah nothing. I guess I guess he just did a little vignette around it or something. I like think that. so. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. it seems to be soft all around here. But yeah, yeah. it's I kind like of abrupt. This. But I like this. It's I think cool if you shot, cropped, though. I think you cropped it from the top and the bottom, it might have been. I didn't nice. know he had any transformers, man. Optimus Prime in a desert. That's pretty cool. No, I'm just kidding. I know what it is. <laughs> I was about to say, I hope you know what this is. <laughs> I know it's a space marine. I'm just playing. Um, I love the desert tone. I don't know what he if it's the AI generated or what, but he did a great job with this, making its own little landscape that works. You know, it looks alien. I like it a lot. Uh, and yeah. the effect he got on here was really good. And remember, remember when Warforged used to just throw a bunch of effects in too, like uh, oh, we got the cropper. Yeah, I was about to say a, a tight crop like that. I think. Um, I think something like this would have been kind of cool. Yeah. I mean, I would like to see a little bit more over here. You know what I mean? Like, so it was a little bit more on the third, but not much. Mm. I mean, because this is the focus. They're looking at this thing, right? Like, so mm -hmm. that's on. <clears throat> on your third you still get a really cool landscape around him but there isn't a lot of like i don't care i don't know what the hell that was but I mean, this is, cause there's <laughs> oh because of the little white arrow yeah because the little white arrow so it's like um on. <laughs> yeah it's on it's on it's, it's on, on like donkey kong <laughs> yeah i think something like that could have been cool. yeah yeah it is a i think i would have gotten a little more depth on it but like it's it's cool i like it it's a nice over the over the shoulder. I don't know. The, the one yeah. thing that's missing when you crop it like that, though, um, I'm going to take it back to the original, is I like this mountainscape or, or cloudscape or whatever this is way out here, too, though. I like that. I mean, I see what you're saying. You don't want to, nah. right? You want to, but I, I I don't like losing this. I, I really like this. Then move the figure up. You know what I mean? I move the figure up. I, it, mm -hmm. it also kind of looks like a, he's a little, I don't, like he's a little low to the ground. Like, yeah. You know, like the angle of that you're looking over his shoulder, I would think that the ground would be further down unless he's like in a trench or something. Mm -hmm. And he I'm not trying to nitpick down. because of that, but like if he had been up a little more, you would have seen a little bit more of that background or something like yeah. that. You know? mm -hmm. Yeah. Little... He, he's a big guy, though. So, yeah, I can see what you're saying. Yeah, it's a dope shot though. I, I yeah, like, yeah, more for yeah, it. Like this is great, man. I like I like the fact that you're taking this in a whole different direction. I'm really, I'm mm -hmm. really astounded by that, man. Good, good on you, man. Good on you. Yeah, right. I wonder if that's a real background or if he, you know, did his whole digital superimposing. Even thing. if he did, I think he did a great job with it. I think I think oh. it all worked really well. I'm just curious. Oh, it good. Well, he'll get to us. Let us know. Uh, Warforged man, thank you so much. Oh, this is my reshoot, so we'll we'll save that for next week. Uh, Jesse, hey, we finally got to this one. Yes, this oh. shot by Jesse was fantastic, man. Like, what a 3D yeah, printed model, he said. Mm hmm. Hey, this is a great. I, I love this, man. What do you do? Cast some light through that? Mm -hmm. Or no, he is. He, he did astrology photography. Backlit it, right? Yeah. Well, you said he also did astrology photography or something. 
Well, the yeah, the sunlight, is, the sun shot is his shot. Yeah, or oh, Mercury. Sorry, Mercury. Okay. Yeah, Mercury. Yeah, and he just used. So that, he just did uh, this shot, the second shot, with him on the the alligator clip, and then uh, superimposed it over his Mercury shot. That's nice, man. That's, that's mm -hmm. really cool. yeah, Jesse, man. This this may be sad that this wasn't a real figure. That this was a on, well, on the it, it is the sun shot, but Mercury is that tiny little speck. Remember? Oh, that's Mercury right. Water. Yeah, that's yeah. right. He was right there. Yeah, where Mercury, he points right? yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, wow. Well, fine. Which but, he captured right there at the bottom of the. He has it on the bottom yeah. of right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Just that's cool. cool. I mean, it's such a cool yeah. It's such an awesome shot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, in fact, this 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 one uh, we're it's, it's going to have to happen because you know. <laughs> Deep. Russell no longer needs the wishing, mind you. I cropped it just for you, Trevor. Thanks. Thanks. All right, moving on, Jesse. Thank you so much, man. It's beautiful. Ooh, Doughboy snaps. Oh, dang. Oh, oh. Oh, that's different. Yeah, this is a, a whole different thing. Let's see what else is over here. Okay, uh, I like the first one still. Okay, all right. Well, the second one's not bad. It kind of gives me like, oh yeah, I'm in the dark and shining a flashlight and i'm playing a video game where everything is in night vision but i still can't see everything so i have to use a flashlight <laughs> mm, i like the first one the first one's nice the first one it's nice because everything's lit like if, yeah like if we're the game the gamer playing using the night goggles night vision goggles the other one is more hey but it's like it's still too dark i need to put a, 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 yeah. a flashlight on the second one yeah you go. <laughs> yeah the other one's like she's using the clipped on flashlight that goes on her mm -hmm. on her backpack yeah, I feel yeah. like this one better though. I know, okay. I know, we're going for it in the other one, but I like cool this concept, one. man. Great idea. Very nice. And this is where that green, that the whole green tone, kind of works for the shot, though, because you're going to that night vision thing, and it, and it really works. Pretty cool. I like this. this I like the effect. hands coming around the door. That's the elbow <laughs> joints are a little iffy though, because they look kind of weird. But mm -hmm. you can't do much. I mean, about that. This is a figure. Is that the Red Death's hand? No, it's not. Is it? <laughs> I don't know. This one could be. I don't know. Could be. It almost looks like it. I was like, man, that's that's a good idea that you said. Yeah. Good cool stuff. shot, man. Good stuff. Yeah. Oh boy, thank you so much for sharing, it, buddy. Yeah. Uh, moving on. What we got here? Uh, Bronx Bat. Super <laughs> shot, man. I, I really dig the concept. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, you know, we got to pull them off the backgrounds, work with your lighting, give it some more, like, tonal lighting and not just bright, bright light. Went into the... Yeah, this could be fun, but, like, yeah. Everything's just too just bright. The, yeah. Too bright. It, yeah. 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 Well, they spent a little too much time in the hood. Yeah. But I love the concept, man. You get some great yeah. ideas, man. Let's keep 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 working on them. Let's Tighten just... that up. Like, if you had two of them, like, sitting on flip those barrels over i don't know if they flip over but if they do like or sitting on something like they're just like kind of hanging outside and and looking at each other and talking you know what i mean like just yeah. just chilling that'd be kind of nice i mean how much for that boom <clears throat> bot <clears throat> yeah <laughs> yeah anyway all right we'll move on Let's find the word to your mummy right? That's the <laughs> word to your mummy yeah <laughs> for, man. Look at that. oh damn oh shit <laughs> this is the the hasbro the, yes uh, this I actually have this. I haven't shot it in a long. Well, I've never shot it. Sure I have it too. I've never shot it. This is nice, man. This feels like you know, like the hell, Ghost Rider, man. Like, are, are those uh, like, little dusties down the bottom there? Mm -hmm. Ooh, like There's a dude here. I don't know who that is. Yeah, but the the smoke effect with like a little bit of uh, like blast coming out from it. I've never yeah. seen that before. Where's that from? What? I don't know this that, here. Uh, yeah, I don't know what the blast is. Uh, I thought they were those were little dynamic little dusties who that. Uh, um, That's what I thought so too. Um, with the blast coming out of it. I'm not familiar with that one though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Is like I'm, I'm, I'm familiar with the Tamashi Nations one because I have that, but it's more of a wave effect. That's like clear water, but oh, you geez. double it as smoke. But this is different. I never seen that before. But it's cool. You like, did a good job lighting the fire on the tires and then underneath the, the background there and the like all that looks really well lit. Yeah, look at the back <laughs> of the it's lit. Like, there's a lot of shadows and contrast. And, and the flame on Ghost Rider's head. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. Kind of like the second shot, too. Oh, there's a second shot? A little more. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah, I like this chain. The way he has the chain on this one yeah. better. Yeah. Yeah. I think the other one, the chain needed to be the other way around, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah this is nice. It's good. Yeah, man. Good shot, I'm digging this, man. I'm digging it, man. You're Casper. You're killing it, man. Killing it. Thank you so much, Casper. Move on. Very Raven nice. Eyes. Uh, well, again, this is like umpteenth Raven Eyes shot. Yeah, sorry, here. Raven Eyes. Need some more light, though. Need some more light on this one. Yeah. 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 Uh, move on. Ooh, what? Ooh. Something weird happened with the crop, or or whatever. It did a weird thing. Hold on, let me see. It it, it made it too big. It yeah, did it. And it went big. yeah, it did. Hold on. This is a three zero MDLX series, I think. Uh, yes, yes, and uh, it looks great. Uh, Pablo, you gotta. Yep, gotta... I got it. I'm bringing it up right now. All right, I'll let you do that. I won't click it. I'll let you do it. Go. Also, it looks like he's using the um, what was it? A human alliance uh figure. Uh, Reen or something that's well, it's trying to look like Spike and Spark Plug, man. Exactly, there, you always wore that outfit on the oil rig or whatever. Yeah, mm -hmm. which is really is there a behind the scenes in this one? Because I want to know what know, that you little... got control now, man. Oh, yeah, he does have behind the scenes. I want to know what the little camper is. Yeah, oh, look at that. Wait, where's the oh, oh, damn, he's using force perspective. yeah, he's, he's a lot of force perspective here. Wow, and he's great with uh, some. House plants that you could buy it like you know your your homes department store stuff. That's mm -hmm. cool. Yeah, that's fantastic. Real good, cool. good force perspective on this one. Yeah, okay. I'm just it's like, Instagram they, they, mine. Back, um, <clears throat> Get it for a shot. <laughs> good stuff, man. Any any uh any word to the wise here? Mm -hmm. Wise, he showed me something different. All right, all right. Mm. Yeah, good shot. Right, nice. good. You can take it back, Moss. All right, I'm gonna take it back. I'll, I'll keep it here just in case that uh, happens again. Oh, five oh first. This is your third one, though. Is it... Wait, is it a third one? Yeah, he had uh, he had the the first clone trooper we started with, and there was another one in the middle. I forget what it was, but it was it was one of his. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, this is a good shot too. The first one, the black the first one, the the, the one in the rain, rain one. one. Yeah, the rain one. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I like using good. the uh, that's like an apple. Dicer, that was kind of cool, what? but um, I mean, that's you know, Star Wars shape. I just think you need oh, to have oh. that a little more defined because it's hard to tell what we're yeah. looking at in front of him. Like, I that's thought it was a figure at first, I was trying to define you know the figure, so maybe just back up the camera a little bit more or increase your depth of field just a little bit more. Or... Yep, yeah. but I think the camera is too close, it's probably what it is. But it's a cool idea. Mm -hmm. That's a cool idea. That really works. That is a great use of that that tool. Though. Like, that yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. It I mean, I might like sacrifice one and paint it black so you don't get those reflections <laughs> and stuff too. Yeah. But no oh, reflections. That's or you know, just get the green out. The paint. You got you got Photoshop this green out or crop it out. But it's still good though, man. It's a good idea. Yeah. Great use yeah. of. Oh, it's a great ingenious use of using uh, like little household items, man. Yeah. So this was a kitchenware challenge. He said yeah. use an apple Ooh. slicer to shoot through. That is awesome. Oh, nice. I would also try to get this more like head level, this circle, and or maybe like over here on the thirds up here, though. Uh, I don't know. We might have cut through his head a little bit. You might have had to reposition yeah. things. I think if it's just higher. defined, like the circle part kind of dies around his the elbow. Her, her elbow part, the right? Yeah. 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 But it is, just in general, you think the center of the window is going to be more head height than, than, than way down here. That's all. Yeah. I just feel like. I don't know. It should be higher, but I don't know. You can play with it. Play with it. Uh, Wade says uh, nice. that slicer does look like the front yeah. of a, of a mm -hmm. fighter. It does, man. It does, yeah. <laughs> like, I never really thought about it, but yeah, it does. Yeah. It's a good idea. Great stuff, man. Clone Wars, man. Great stuff. All right, we're going to move on. Uh, we got Bronx Bat again. Yeah, this is his fourth. No, this is like seventh, dude. Is it? Oh, yeah, it is yeah. the seventh shot. Yeah. We've been going through it today, man. Yeah, we're making uh, headway. Uh, and again, we got all the same same comments for each one of these, so I'm just gonna move on because at least on this one, you don't see the harsh shadows. Yeah, I still see the harsh shadow right there by the fireplace on the bottom. Yeah. Oh yeah, on the bottom of the yeah 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 that rim. But I'm talking about like the harsh shadows from the figures onto the background. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 
But he's still overexposed. Yeah, he's still, yeah. You got the interesting lighting at all. It's just one harsh light. Yeah, you so, just think about it. figures in dimension as opposed to just figures flat, you know, <clears throat> the same depth from each other, you know, parallel looking sideways. Have one looking out at the other one and the other one's, you know, back turned or something like that. Or, mm -hmm. you know, you got to you gotta get some connection between these things. Yeah. All right, Bronx. We'll move on, buddy. Um, ooh, Pop Fella, number two. This is a nice one. Nice That's angelic pretty. figure, man. You guys discuss it. Grab another drink. Very, very dreamy. Yeah, this is pretty. Mm -hmm. This is a dope shot. I love this. This is cool. Very nice. Yeah, just color-wise, lighting-wise, mm -hmm. uh, the softness this this of it. And, like, I don't know if she's actually has something she's wearing or if it, it looks like she's, like, she's you know, coming out of that liquid. <laughs> and it's creating like a you know a like skirt a and it's pretty cool yeah yeah it's really oh, cool. like if she's wearing kind of like a some type of veil or something like that Does yeah that, it's either yeah that but it's or... made out of like the liquid she's come out of it or something and it's yeah that's kind nice. of like creating like a it's really cool well it's, I, I think it's her, i think it's her wings because it's a fairy according to the okay yeah this is a beautiful yeah, just the way he did it looks great yeah it looks yeah it looks beautiful yeah it's very dreamy I like that a lot. That's that's awesome. Hey guys, I gotta I gotta run for a minute. All right, okay. All right. No, this is dope. Move on, man. That was beautiful. Ooh, one. Nice. Batman crawling away from is that Batman? I can't tell who he's crawling away from. That's the problem. Well, I think he just got his ass whooped and he's getting but I, you can't tell the problem. You can't tell anything about this. There's a person well, thing coming towards him, but I don't know who. Whoever it was put Batman's ass on the ground. So yeah, he just hurt. That's it. That's all you need to know. Batman's hurt. I need to know more. I'm clicking on that. Would I like it's to know? A good, more. It's a Batman. good pose on Batman, though. Like you could really see the struggle that he got. His he he's gonna have to. He underestimated whoever he was. Yeah, yeah I, I appreciate that, then. but I do want to see that. I mean, even if I can't tell who it is, I want it to see a bit more represented clearly. Like just clear. He's just. I think he's too bokeh out. I'm, I'm even, fine with the even if I still know it is, I still want a bit more depth of field to see like the shape better. I feel I'm like I'm not seeing I'm it. Very much. Hey, fine with it being that book with up. Yeah, because the focus is Batman and him hurt. Because so, if you if you if you look at it at a, at a, as a still from a movie, it would be that book without because then they would have to go on him and then they would zoom in into whoever was in the background if it was like a movie or happening. Toy so, uh Tomatetic, to answer your question, this is the hot toys. Hot, hot toys batman so this is gonna yeah. be a hot toys figure back here whoever yeah. that is. I don't know who that is but... maybe uh, that's broken out because he's like okay he doesn't really belong there but i need a body yeah probably yeah. but but this is according to all the tags is a hot toys so okay hot toys you know pretty tight uh trevor's got this figure of hot toys i don't have it i kind of wish i did get it but then uh, i don't want to spend the money so guess what i don't have it Oh, yeah, good stuff though, Pug One man. This is really nice, man. Mm -hmm. I mean, we'll all argue about that, but I kind of wish I could see more of an outline. I, I, I see representation though, so it's all that really matters, I guess. So, uh, moving on, Raven Eye. Good shot, Raven Eye. That's all we say. Yeah, Raven Eye, man. This is a cool shot, man. I like the Neomorphs. Moving on. Corner, Greg. Two, That's man. Greg. Oh, some Lego. Are we gonna stop on Greg? Is that no, we're gonna keep going. Oh my God, we're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. Oh, the comes back. back. Give me oh. one second. I have to. Um, uh, he has to get ready. Get I have to get set up. Give me a second. I'm still on stream. Just give me a second. All right. Okay. This Pablo, is a cool shot. You're, you're, you're you're a Lego guy. Go for it, man. No, this is a cool shot. Um, I would have wanted her face a little sharper. I mean, I know her, you're, you have your focal point on her, but her face still looks a little soft. I don't know if that's due to the compression from Instagram. But the overall shot is awesome. And that Lego build in the back, that's awesome too. <laughs> you did a good job with this shot. It, it's not easy to shoot Lego. No, no. I haven't even tried to shoot Lego, so I'm going to have to agree with you. It's it's not easy because I haven't tried it, which means it's impossible. It's pretty good. It's well lit. I, I think I may want it maybe a lit, like a, a bounce card on the right side camera right just to bring in a little bit more light on the two guys on the right side 
Mm. Just to give it just to give it a little bit more detail. Not 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 a whole lot of light, but just so you can get a little bit more detail of like the saddle and the cape and then the horse on the back behind the first rider over here, like he's completely gone. You can't really make out what he's riding. Yeah, you do kind of lose it over here. But the fog effect on here is great too, man. Yeah. Good shot, man. It's a clean shot. Mm -hmm. I like it. Uh, we're not going to go much further, though. I know Trevor's not going to be here, but I don't want to go up to Mike's and pass it while he's not here because it's his really good, you know, flying car one or whatever. The Joker and the Rocket. Oh, no. We, we got a long way before that. No, we don't. We don't? I just was looking at it. No, we don't. What? Now I've lost where we are. Hold on. There's that one. There's the Lego. No, dude. We Because after that is the, the Cosmic. Morris. Morbius, and then another mythic, mythic. We got like 10 photos to get to his. Yeah, yeah. No, we won't make it to Just saying. I don't want to go that far. I don't want to get to his. I want, I want him to be, for it, be here for it. Okay. All right. Well, we can yeah, stop yeah. on the shop. We can stop on the shop before that one. All right. Greg, man, that was beautiful. Archer. We got this guy. He's just enjoying yeah. the day in the sun, which oh, is not real sun. Look at that. Ooh. Ooh. I like that poster. Though. It's nice, though. It's nice. It looks pretty pretty natural, although in a, in, in in a controlled environment, natural. It still looks natural. If that makes any sense? Nice. I'm paying attention. No, no, I'm sorry. I'm looking at the shot. That's why. You're stupid. My... Looking at porn on the internet. <laughs> Not a tumor. Is it a tumor? No, that's a cool shot. Um, I like the lighting a lot on this. I'm just trying to. At first, I was thinking maybe he needed to like crop it in a little tighter, but then you would lose the staff in the bottom. I, I actually I think it's fine the way it is. Um, I'm, and I like how like you can tell the sun <clears throat> is behind him to the right because you get that. It's not extremely hot, but it's a little hot on that shoulder pauldron. And, mm -hmm. and on top of that dome of his head. It's cool. Good shot. All right. Moving on, Arthur. Thank you so much. Morbius Ooh. and new. Ooh. And Trevor's not here for more and new. <laughs> I mean, we got the Paramount Light, which a Newell likes to do. Yep. But it is different. He's not walking. You know, so we got to give him that. But it is the Paramount Light effect that he likes to do, so. Other than him not walking, it's kind of similar. I'm not Still used to not seeing him. I'm not knocking it. It looks no, good. No, it's, it's a great shot. I'm just not used to not seeing any smoke effects in his shot. Or any dirt. For yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's the smoke, smoke effect would have been. There's smoke effect, effect would have been cool. Yeah, there's a brick wall. But I think the like a little bit of fog or like mist around him, or like if he was kneeling in the pool of, of mist, like fog, like use that dry ice effect. You, would, you know what would be good to put underneath him is that, that blood effect from the uh oh from, from the, the red death. The red death. Yeah, that would have been cool. Yeah. But then he would have needed to put a body there because then we're all no, it could just be a puddle of blood, man. Like he's going nuts from the blood. You don't have huh? to see the body it can be implied, like it's further up the, towards that's the camera true. that you just that's true. It. That's true. Yeah, that could work. So that'd be kind of you cool. Can, you can even use the um oh, no, you're the here. portable. Yeah, I'm here. I'm listening. Um, you can even use the portable lab that he comes with and just put it there. Like he has a failed experiment. Oh like he's yeah, that would have been tight. Yeah, because you know? mm -hmm. he does come with a lot of shit. He does. Yeah. Don't that's... don't just stop short and do your Paramount one thing, man. Come on, uh, I know yeah, that suitcase. You got it. I know you and, got it, didn't you? And it has that light up. I mean, you wouldn't be able to see the light up feature if we're looking at it from behind. Yeah, that's true. Case, but you could you could have had the pistol and the serum and all that stuff like on the well, side where yeah. That's the thing. You can lift up the the case and and have the top portion like hanging off a little bit, right? Or have something prop it yeah. up or yeah. blue tack just to uh emphasize that he's using his portable lab and he's failed at another experiment. Yep. He's just pissed. Yep. Mm. Yeah, that I could definitely see that. I'm gonna have to run with that idea now. Dude, I haven't even shot this guy yet. I've had him. Freaking you know. biter. <laughs> hey, I didn't copy your idea. That was mm. my idea, the turtle shot. So, because mm. <laughs> you're doing right. the thing. <laughs> Moving on, Anul. Thank you so much for sharing. Oh, because you Sorry, bit my Morbius idea with uh, body swap with Vex. Oh. 
<laughs> SC like caught him red handed. <laughs> All right, here's Raven Eye again. Uh, Raven, I'm not going to get too in depth here, but I, I can't tell which figure you're focused on. Maybe him? I don't know. But on oh, this one, it was. It looks, hold on, it looks like he back. redid the shot that he had before. Well, he's didn't. telling the, he's telling a story. Like he has yeah. each week for the Mythic Legions collab, he's posting a different. So there's like a battle between these two. And then okay. each shot's a different. It's a different. Um, uh, why can't I think of the word? It's a storyboard, like a storyboard, like a different storyboard, like a different image of an event that's going on between these two characters. Okay, so if, if that's the case, then I would suggest change the position or change the character to show a different perspective to help tell the story of the storyboard. Because it looks like it's the same shot, just done a little bit better with the lighting that we were requesting. Considering your focus was was the Vlad Tepes looking guy to begin with, and now your focus uh, apparently on the whatever this guy is in the background, the unknown. I don't I don't like the way you changed that. I think we should have taken the camera and gone over this guy in the background and looking towards Vlad again. You know, Lou, you're killing me yeah. with noises. I'm sorry, I'm walking out the door. That's why I know. <laughs> I know what you're doing, but you're killing me. Wow. But yeah, the lighting is is really good on this one, though. Like everything's. Yeah. Just, the, the the focus is soft on both characters. Like I mean. Yeah. Just it's just weird. But good uh, shot yeah. though, Raven. Yeah, great stuff, Raven. Moving on though. Thank you so much. Uh oh, Scopator. This is new. Oh. All right. There we go. This is new. Maybe she got the other card. Um, Some more Mythic Legions peoples. Mm -hmm. Some more Mythic Legions peoples. <laughs> this is one of my grail figures I need to get. What, the girl here? Yeah, Delfina. What's her name? Del Del Boo -boo? Delfina? Delfina. Her name? Mm. Brandon Brown says that the, the shot <clears throat> of Batman is it was Bane in the background. Oh, was it? Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. All right. Cool. Bane's cool, man. Sorry, I just no, it's good. Don't be sorry. You got things to do. But thank you for joining. Yeah, thanks for joining, man. Yeah, man. Even though, <laughs> even though, yeah, we're, <laughs> we're, we're wrapping up. We're, hey, you know, we're wrapping up pretty close, man. So no, don't feel don't 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 ever say sorry. You could always catch up. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Even after the fact, you can know. We got about three more shots, and we gotta stop. Oh, actually, no, two more shots because the other one's Mike's too. So we gotta stop. No, the other one is it Mike's? Well, no, Pennywise oh, in the same oh, car? Yes, that's Mike. It is. I thought it was okay. Okay. So we're gonna wait for Mike. We don't want to. We don't want to talk one, about Mike. Two, three, Mike. four shots to go, and we're done. I don't know how you learn how to count. What do you mean? Because <laughs> we're gonna skip shots. So let's right. go. You, you count. Okay. All right, I let's see. go. Let's go. What's this one? Warhammer, a Star Wars, and then another. Talk about Skeletor. Skeletor. Let's go. Skeletor. Yeah. No, this is a good shot. Like, I, I love, I love the lighting on this shot. I wish there was a little bit more light on her face, though. A little, I can see a little bit of warm light on her face, but I, the only thing I think the more lighting would help was on her hair because her hair looks. Yeah, maybe awesome. to pull her out of that too. But I would also yeah. like a little bit more light on her face. I think her I put her light on her face. <laughs> her complexion is a little dark, and it, you just need to brighten her up some more because she's starting to fall into this darkness back here, even though you get a fire right behind her. So this guy should be lit up more from that fire, and the back of her should be lit up more, and I'd like a little bit more light on her face. Thank I'll you. give her some wood for the fire. No, <laughs> <Lou>, you're fired. <laughs> Go to work, Lou. <laughs> I'm going to have to run out of that door. You, you, you bet you. You just wait. Oh, it's freezing already. You ain't gonna if it's freezing out here, it ain't gonna rain. It's gonna snow, baby. So I ain't worried about it. <laughs> All right. But good shot though, man. Yeah, great stuff. Yeah, nice shot, nice shot. Man, I love the setup, like the battle going on in the back. See yeah, those skeletons. It's a very coming interesting in. shot. There's a lot going on. I like it. I just want to yeah. pull a little bit more light on her face to bring her out a little bit because this is our focal character. I want to be able to see her 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 you know her attributes better, you know, clearer. Awesome. And, that's what uh, I'm gonna call them now, right? <laughs> I'm not going dirty. Come on now. And I also want some some rim lighting from this fire behind her to light her up and to light this guy up more back here because this fire should be lighting him up. You shouldn't be dark here at all. That's true. Um, so you got to keep in mind where your light sources are and try to try to light it as best you can. Uh, it is a lot of work, and sometimes you have to cheat. You know, if you want to do it and make it look right, you got to 
light paint, you know, do several shots with lights from different directions, which I do from time to time, just to make sure I got everybody lit up because I can't get a light in the middle of the shot like that. So, you know, it can happen. Just uh, okay. keep, keep okay. up the good work, though. Thank you for participating. Love to see some more. <laughs> Raven Eye. Oh. oh, that's what you were saying. I didn't realize that the other the two Warhammers were Raven. Were they? I didn't even look at that. Now I'm just I'm just okay. saying that. Trevor's got to go. All right. All right, Bye, Trevor. Trevor. Bye, Trevor. Thank you for storming the castle with us. Get well, man. So get some rest, man. Get some rest. Man, I, I will say this, man. I'm digging this this shot, uh, especially a black character trying to make that appear well is hard to do, and you did okay with that. Uh, I get a little bit of rim light behind the head here. You got it on this thing, which is nice, but there's like nothing on the head to pull it off this black. Yeah, a little bit of rim light on that. Yeah. So just keep that in mind. But thank you, Raven Eye. Uh, again, Raven Eye. Same thing. And I like the aliens thing. This is the Hyatt Toys aliens, I would yep. assume. Um, this is a torch, though, so this should all be lit up. Uh, and then, of course, you still need to pull it off this black because it's a black figure. You got to do your best to pull it off of there. Um, but other than that, yeah, great, great scene, though. Great scene. We move on. Uh, zigzag zoom. There we go. Sunny. This is dope. Nice. I like this shot. I like this shot a lot. Yeah, and we actually like gonna stop here. That way, we can actually go over Raven Eyes next shot. How about that? We'll stop with Zigzag Zoom. That Raven Eyes also. Yeah, yeah Raven Eyes. <laughs> um, I like the setup. It's very clean. Um, yeah, it's very, very cinematic. Also, like it's got the film green on it, or like the film. It has a grain to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I can see that, and um, I like the illusion of uh, him getting choked up, but it's yeah. being blocked by. The body of another um, soldier there, which is cool. Yep, that's very, very, very clever, very nice. I love everything about this shot. There's a nice mm -hmm. soft lighting in here, but yet it's sterile. It looks great. I love that. Dialogue. I do have one point of contention. I don't think it. I think it's beyond Sunny's control. But there's something about the way this goes around his neck that makes him look like he's got his head back like this weird. Like, hold on, hold on you mess up the camera. His head yeah. back like this or something or like really. Vader's like, like yeah, like Vader. Yeah, I noticed that too. I yeah. noticed that I think too. It's beyond his control. I think it's just something with the the, with the, the costuming or yeah. whatever. I don't know how yeah. you do that, but um, yeah, I think this is these are quarter scale, aren't they? Uh, mm -hmm. quarter scale. You you mean three fourths? You mean uh, one? Yeah, yeah. This is one eighteen scale. I think one eighteen scale is what I mean. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Three and three quarter. Three and three quarters is what I meant to say. Oh, okay. Yeah. A quarter scale. <laughs> you know, like quarter scale? That looked no, like no, no. Real Darth Vader if it was quarter scale, man. It'd be looking good. <laughs> no, I meant three and three quarters. The, the little three and three quarters is what I meant to say. Yeah, I think this is the three and three quarter inch. Oh. Because that dial is awesome, too, man. Yeah, this is a beautiful diorama, man. I like this shot, Sonny, man. This yeah, is, this is an I awesome just, shot, like said, The figure is got this weird... Maybe it's even the cape just making his neck look it's crunched back. I don't know, but just like, I think it's just that little the thing cape that come up like this. I think that's yeah. the reason. Yeah, yeah. I think the cape's creating the illusion. Yeah, yeah it's giving the uh, kind of like that scrunched neck down thing is weird. Yeah. Um, but yeah, other than that, man, this is awesome. This is awesome. Very nice. Man, we are done for the day. We left off on sunny zigzag zoom. Trevor, or not Trevor, uh, Pablo, commit that to your memory. Sure. Because I have shitty memory. I won't remember. Yeah, I remember. I remember. Just remember, it's a Vader shot. <laughs> right before Mikey's uh, rocket shot. So. Oh, well, next week we're on the reshoot, although there's not a lot of people reshooting, I've noticed. So maybe uh, maybe it won't happen. Next week's the 26th, right? Yeah, I believe so. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Yeah, should be. Yeah, should That's be. supposed to be when we're supposed to go over reshoots. So, guys, um, if you want to participate in that, we're going to do a show. Nothing... Man, I, I don't know. Should we? <laughs> I was like, is there enough people that did the um, uh, hashtag toy reshoot due by March 25th? So, uh, if you want okay. to pick in that, I'll try to find all the reshoots. I don't know how I'm going to do it. Because... I keep forgetting to ask Will about that site that he uses to look over the hashtags. Who, what, who uses the site? What 
the with the highly posable there's a i forgot the name of the site that he goes through that it allows him to go through all the hashtags the well, you need hashtags. to ask him when you talk to him next please yeah, I, need to. I, oof, I don't know how we do it. I'll talk to you, him know, you know what it would, it would be nice to see um to see First. everybody who's doing the reshoot to uh put the original shot in the back of the yeah shot you want a carousel of the original shot yeah. put, put yeah, so, carousel. Yeah. I, want, I want the original shot and the reshoot you guys got so by the uh, March 25th. I want to have them in by then. So maybe the optimal thing to do is for me to actually have this pre-planned and not have to dig through Instagram for it and pull them all down. That's yeah, the optimal. That, Will I do yeah. that? I don't know. That's the yeah. optimal thing. So I'd like to have them all in by the 25th. No, nah, that's a requirement. No, no, that's a requirement. It's a requirement. Uh, yes, but you're not going to require work afterwards. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm, ta- I'm saying for the people. I'm saying for the people to take the to do the reshoot, the hashtag reshoot. Yeah. And to do the reshot um, with the hashtag, put your uh, original photo as the second image and the new photo as your main image. Yeah, we, that way yeah. we see it. Do a carousel. It's the first one. And then you do the carousel. Exactly. Yeah. So your first image and then your second image. The first image is the new one. Second image is the carousel, the original. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. You want to re- re- revisit a shot and see if you do it any better. I know I didn't do mine any better. I'm kind of sad about that. Um, just because of the special effect I did. Um but uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna pull that down. Uh, banners gone. Cool. There we go. Um, but anyway, yeah, that's it. That's all we got, guys. Um, so next week we're gonna do the hashtag toy reshoot. That's the planned show. So please, uh, if you want to participate, get those in. Um, and with that, Pablo, Lou, either of you got anything going on? Uh, you had half half show Saturday on your channel, Lou, last Saturday. <laughs> yeah, last Saturday. Um, this Saturday I will not be doing it. I'll be watching. Right. Um, Ghostbusters Frozen Empire on that Saturday, so right. I will be sleeping so I can wake up and go to the movies with the family and uh, friends to watch that, eat some popcorn, and go do some. Um, I'll be seeing the Friday then, morning. So, nee, 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 nee. That's okay. I work. So, oh, um, Pablo. So, <laughs> I love this shot. So, Pablo. yeah, I just wanted to yeah, say, I was gonna say Pablo. That- Congrats so, on this shot. Yeah, I was going to say... Vote uh, for Pablo on Toy Pick Community for this, man. This should yeah. win. If it doesn't win, I'm just going to boycott the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, I got nominated on this, so... Yeah, That's like. just so beautiful. Thank you. Nice. I'm Love trying you. to get nominated, bro. I'm going to throw another shot in there. See what happens <laughs> for next week. All right. <laughs> All right. Anyway, with that being said, then, um, we'll be back Tuesday, the 26th, for Toy Reshoot. That's the plan. If not, we'll just fall back into our regular rut of, uh, you know. So, do we have any uh, guests coming up, Pablo? No, not yet. I haven't heard back okay. from anybody. I'm gonna reach out to um, to Jules again and see if she wants to hop on. Okay. At the end um, of the month. I don't want to yeah. overbook us for a couple weeks if we can help it okay. though. I want to work through these. I want to try to get through like we did tonight. I want to push okay. through a lot of this. And when we have a bigger panel, as much as I appreciate all their support and everybody being here. We don't move as fast. <laughs> we need to get TJ nah. in here too. Nah, yeah. you know what it is? We oh, yeah. we we stay um strong on a subject, and then we go into a tangent, and then we, we want to be like, oh yeah, but this too, and then it, it just keeps going on. So um, it's like there was a there was a few tangents that needed to get you know. <laughs> yeah, a few tangents, but I'm talking about when we're talking about a photo, just the oh, photo, yeah, yeah, not yeah. the tangents. Oh the yeah, tangents yeah, yeah, yeah. We can talk about, and it'll be like maybe two minutes long. But when we get a tangent on the photo. It's a lot longer than our normal changes. True. You know what I mean? Pablo, so, Pablo you need Trevor. Me, don't you? <laughs> no, I don't need that. Yes, you no. do. Look at that. I'll, I'll get the I was say, This is a Trevor, Skype feel one. better? I'll get the Mesco one. Mesco one. <laughs> I have the Mesco one. This I know, one. but I'll, I'll get the Mesco one. You don't I'm have saying. the Mesco one? No, I never got it. No. Man, this guy is... Dude, I've, I've never liked a sideshow piece as much as I like this one. It looks dope. Don't get me wrong, but I just don't have space for one six scale. You can make. I space. mean, I, as it is, I, I don't have any of my one twelve scale displayed anywhere. <laughs> so mm. like, <laughs> All right, we're gonna get out the turtles. Here, Except for the have turtles. Yep, yep. Yeah, yeah. Have a great night, guys. We'll see Later. you all next week. Yes. Enjoy. Sir. Good night. A long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away.